Good morning, everyone, and welcome to the Bowls New South Wales State Championships for 22-24, correction, 23-24, good math. Uh, I'm Benny Two Shoes, and joining me today once again, as has been for the last couple of weeks, Bowls Australia Club Support Manager, Mr Jason Pinnock. Morning, Benny. Uh, great day for play today. Looking forward to uh, this match this morning, and I'll hand straight back to Benny, and we'll get into it. Yeah, no excuses here. Beautiful day. You can see the flags barely moving, light breeze. These guys have just kicked off. It's uh, Warren Shipley, famous bowler in New South Wales, and another famous bowler, Robbie Warren, uh, from Taraji Park. It's going to be something else. Should be a ripper of a game. Yeah, so at the moment we see Warren holding one. We do. Benny just had, to, had a couple of little technical glitches just right before roll-up, so he's got in and got them fixed. And we are on N1, and this is the final bowl. And that will be the only technical glitches for the day. Yeah. I can't promise that, but, geez, I'm hoping. So, first end, Warren Shipley has got himself a shot. So he's opened up his account. <coughs> and, um, look, from all reports, too, um, they're saying Warren Shipley has been in some sort of form in his sectional play. Um, talking to a lot of other people around. So he needs, he's going to have to be in some good form because we know how good a player Robbie Warren is. Yeah, he's a gun, absolutely. He's, uh, and once again, another one of those well-known players in the state. Uh, he's been around. It's good to see. So it's interesting we've got a Zone 16, a uh, Wollongong uh, bowler from Taraji Park and a Newcastle area bowler, Warren Shipley from uh, Soldiers Point. The Soldiers Point crew out in force out there at the moment, actually, by the way. Yeah, and also this morning we've got two other finals happening. On the rink next door, on rink 10, is the Open Reserves final. Yep, that's uh, Steve Smith, known as Splinter. Uh, it's not rotating yet. Yep. Uh, known as Splinter. And Maylene Reynolds from uh, NBC Sports and... Both uh, Maylene in good spirits this morning. I had a quick word to her. I haven't spoken to um, Steve yet. And then the other one that we have, uh, the senior women's. Uh, Wendy Clark versus Vicky Turner. And uh, yep. they're up and about this morning too. Vicky really, she's one of the cheeriest people on the greens at the moment. And I love watching her play. We're really gorillas. Uh, green shirts around, sitting around as well. Yeah, good crowd on the sidelines this morning. Well, plenty of support. Play. <laughs> Looks like plenty of support for Shippo. Yeah, I reckon. <laughs> <laughs> Surprisingly. <laughs> <laughs> no, obviously, obviously he's supporting he's the shirt, not... <laughs> well, well-known man, no, very no. hard worker, obviously yeah. in Zone 2 as their administrator. He's also our state match committee obviously, chairman, so... It's not, not bad for a guy pushing uh, pushing about 86 years old, I think, isn't he? <laughs> so, um, a very hard worker and uh, looking forward to seeing him perform on green. <laughs> so Philip Lovekey, my first comment as always. Welcome, mate. Claire Brown, ahoy. Ahoy to you. Good morning, Claire. <laughs> and uh, Johnny Walker watching from Wollongong as well. Welcome uh, this morning. We had a nice late start, a bit of a sleep in, mate. Yeah, Not well, for you. <laughs> no, I still woke up at 5 a.m. <laughs> <laughs> but that was all good. Got a little bit of admi admin work done myself. Um, yeah, I woke up to a house full of admin, actually. The champion, the champion who draws uh, the... The sports team there working very hard. Yeah, they were. Geez, isn't Robbie Warren a tall bloke? Very tall. And uh, nope. interesting to see him. Uh, keep an eye on him when he plays an aggressive <laughs> shot because, um, wow, they're like a bullet. <laughs> He's just kicking some people off the back of the green there. Yeah, a little bit of movement behind the cameras. So. Yeah, they were. It's funny that they were asked to stand to the side of the green. <laughs> but, nope, there's a big crowd standing down the back. Oh, good shot there, Robbie. Good effort. No, so Shippo that's, holding one. Yeah, Shippo's holding one, and it's the purple one in the middle. So Shippo's found his line superbly early on. He has all three bowls up and down the line. Yeah, these, these guys have come from uh, Macquarie Park. Were they playing there? Uh, so Shippo come from Macquarie Club, and yep. Robbie Warren was at North Dubbo Sporty's RSL. That's it. So, the, so Shippo, probably the advantage is come off a grass green. Potentially yeah. straight away, the... Uh, So Shippo just going around the back there. Okay, Robbie's not on a he's on an all right line here. He's just gonna float through. So it's another one to Shippo. 
Yep. So one, you got one on the last end too, didn't you? you got one on end one, yep. Obviously, ends don't matter. We're playing to... Do they, they play the full count too, don't they? First to 25 it is yep. in all disciplines. We've got the Club Dubbo chairman, Tony Spears, is our marker today. Oh, goodness. Yeah, he loves it too. He loves the bowls. And it shows the... He's um, very supportive of, of bowls. He is um, as a sport. So And he's been loving this, getting amongst everyone. Um been marking he's been volunteering in the backgrounds and that's our that's the main club chairman so really good to see really shows when I, and, and i mean this sincerely when you was concentrating on core business and i'm thinking uh just administratively here mm -hmm. when you support core business which is bowls you can see the success that a club can have uh and uh these guys really get behind it in fact if i'm really clever when this bowl comes down Is that, not, does that stop rotating again? Yeah, let's start again. Yeah, the button's not working over there at the moment, but as you can see, there he is. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> On the signage, is even a main sponsor of the club. Okay, so both guys are a little bit short here. Robbie got shot. Oh, I had the pleasure of actually watching some of Robbie's games over at North Dubbo Sporties on Saturday morning. He... Played against one of my club mates, Des Johnson, and got through on a last end thriller, 25, 24, it was 24 all obviously, so um, got through, 25, 24, good bowl there by yeah, Shippo. And yeah. then I heard in his third round, which was yesterday morning, he was down 24, 22, down game on three ends in a row and killed three in a row. Loves a run. We like, yeah, I've heard, I've heard that. I've got warned about that this morning. Yeah, and then on his on the penult which ended up being the penultimate end, he drew three shots. So he had three kills and then drew a three to win, twenty five twenty four. So yeah, well, wow. look at the crowd here. You can see it on the right hand side of the screen there. Yeah, and, and massive all the crowd back, this morning. Yeah, it's huge. All the four, all the fours teams have turned up to, uh, and, and but I actually can't see many of the players here. Oh, I did see oh, some Cabramatta, there, there's, there's, there's some, over there. there's some yeah. Grafton, Charlestown, so we do have a few fours here already. We're here to have a good go. So the schools will start rotating down the bottom soon. Volunteers still at this stage sorting, getting their positions right and getting into the uh, all the spreadsheets and that. So Robbie, Robbie shot. Great shot, Robbie Warren. Holding one. Shippo might. Oh, Shippo might just be staying on the draw here. Well, he's on a bit of an aggressive line here, so he might be just playing a little bump and run shot. Get any of that bowl. Oh, no. oh, he got the little oh, slide. Oh well, he played the he played draw weight. Because his weight was good, he was no. able to get that result. No cheering, though. <laughs> no, exactly. Dave Corns is here. Pretty Thomas watching from Cornwall in the UK. I think you're the first one from Cornwall I've seen here. Gary Holt, go Shippo, and and uh, Don Gowland, welcome. Just a bit wide yeah. here, Robbie. So Robbie's still. Trying to fill this out a little bit. I must say, that green over at North Dubbo Sporties, he did have to take a lot of grass. They were running at least 18 seconds. So yeah. yeah, they fly. Warren did come off a grass green at Macquarie. It's, it's a bit different in characteristic to this one. See, we'll just say that again. There he is. That's, uh, that's the chairman of the uh, board here. Support, big supporter of the club. He Love is it. actually yes. And that's who's marking. You see him there, famous man. Autographs later. Anyone? Oh, speaking of autographs, that guy from Wirral. I've forgotten his name. Uh, no, I'll think of it later on. But he's here <laughs> signing autographs too. Some real famous dude. 
<laughs> Jimmy McCrory. <laughs> Jimmy McCrory. <laughs> <laughs> uh, he actually said no autographs at all, actually. Yeah. But if you want to go see Jimmy, ask him for an autograph and just make just irritating would be hilarious. Great opening bowl by Shipper. <laughs> so he's fine in his range, nice and early. So yeah, the live scores are down there. I'm just trying to look across the rinks to see if I can see. There are some scores on the scoreboards, but can't quite see. Oh, well done, Robbie. Let's get a shot there. You can see across of Maylene, and there's Kate. She asked me not to do this, so I'm, of course that's what I'm doing. <laughs> She's been working very hard, actually. I get a lot of respect for that lady. Uh, working super hard. She's done every day of this tournament, either marking, turning scoreboards, yeah. uh, looking after the players. It's great. So across the boards... I can see in the open reserves, Cabramatta are up 3-1. And in the senior women's, Warilla are up 4-1 early in their game. So. That's Vicky Turner from Warilla. And uh, Steve Splinter-Smith, Master Splinter like the Ninja Turtles. <laughs> so Shippo just wanting to adjust by about a foot of weight here. He's narrow and he knows it. Walks away from that one straight away. Yep. Whether he was trying to push through a little bit or yeah. not is a, a question, but... Uh, a lot better weight. Look mm -hmm. at that. Yeah. So, Robbie wanting to add to the count here. Does he make contact on his own? Not quite. Well, look out there. It might, it's up and down for shot, actually. Yeah, I'm just... So... Looks different from on the screen. I think um, I think shippo has got it. No, no, it's one down. So yeah. he's one down, so... He really wants to get another one in here because there could be a chance for Robbie to take that second wood out of Shippo's and get himself a big count early on, so... Big bowl here for Shippo. If it doesn't count, get another second... Don't give Robbie that chance. He's coming down on the right track. Is he going to hold? He has. He's good at getting these little edges at the moment. Yeah, wow, <laughs> isn't he? He may not have the shot. Yeah, okay. Robbie Warren holding Warren. one. Yeah. Was that... <laughs> down in uh, Zone 7, we call him a Campbell. There's a guy down there that's famous for getting the little slides. Yeah. A Scottish man. I know a bloke back at my old club at Katingle, Nick Sampson. He's called Nick the Wick. Nick the Wick. <laughs> oh, look at this shot. Robbie Warren. Robbie. Brilliant bowl. Makes two of it. He says, give me the damn mat. The problem is with uh, Nick the Wick, he used to claim that he played for him all the time. <laughs> I was aiming at that. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Two, yep. Yeah. Two paddles go up. Scoreboard's updated, going well. In, a, in the routine, in the zone now, it's been a long time, so we're keeping things updated as we go. Looks like, the, oh, look at the scoreboards are going up as well. Brilliant. Excellent. Well done, team, here at Club Dubbo. Massive amount of volunteers over this. We haven't had two people turn up for the same job this morning, I think, uh, for, <laughs> for the <laughs> scoreboard. They're keen. Team. They're lining up. That was, uh, <laughs> yeah, Johnny, he's... Uh, yeah, so who we got else we got? John Walker here, been there. Kerry Fraser from Nelson Bay. Mark Ross didn't go Shippo. Gary Holt after Shippo as well. Dave Ellis saying that uh, <laughs> saying that Shippo's drive is equivalent to a Robbie Drawbolt. <laughs> Thanks, Junior. <laughs> <laughs> Joe. Warren Daz, uh, you'll have to explain the ATM for me, aka Robbie Warren. Ah, uh, yeah, he's got a nickname, Robbie Warren. I heard it the other day, ATM, because um, he wins all the prize money at the tournament, so he's like an <laughs> <laughs> Automatic teller machine just loaded with funds. <laughs> right. Jeez. Uh, Pete Thomas uh, from yeah Cornwall saying, can't wait to get back playing outdoors in the next month when we open. Great bowl there by Shippo. And he's going to come and have a go. Pete, yep, come down to Husky, mate. We'll look after you. Or uh, Yamba's the other good place, isn't it? <laughs> Apart yeah. from Club Dubbo, clearly. Yeah. And, uh, and these places, yeah, get, get down and have a go. I only plugged our clubs first because I'm biased. So, Robbie looks a little heavy here and is. So yep. Splash. 
good first bowl by Shippo. Rob, Robbie drew, you know, that foot behind. Shippo's come down, trail the jack. Uh, Greg Target saying, good to hear your voice. Triple M. Uh, Greg Target. <laughs> Thanks, Greg. <laughs> <laughs> he's, uh, well, he's been there a little while now at Yamba Bowling Club, but he's the um, assistant, I guess, I don't know exactly what the name of his role is, but he's the assistant to the CEO anyway. So, yep. good to hear from you, Greg. <laughs> I hope Yamba's going well, mate. Triple M. Yeah, it's stuck, <laughs> hasn't it? Kyle Langley, you're a beautiful man. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, yeah, once not... again, so we're just talking about the uh, my offsider and and uh, commentating partner what, for Jesus Robbie essentially Warren. a couple of weeks now. Robbie, Robbie Warren, Warren gets a flop. Oh, he's, I I may have it. shot there. I'm just trying to get that scoreboard off the off the jack a little bit. So. Yeah, one down was the call. Yeah, he'd be seeing Shippo stay on the forehand. Two options, sit the bowl, get the trail of the jack. He can't really hurt it. He's already... Nah. He, his bowl's a toucher, so even if he knocks that in the hole, it's a it's a win. So here it comes. He wants to he's be heavy. area here. Yeah, I think he's going to cut. Yeah, oh, his weight. Yeah, it was just weight. Well, his weight was okay, but obviously not for that line, so... So, Robbie... Oh, and Townie's saying another great day in God's country. 100% right. Sure is, Warren. Hope you're going well, mate. Been good getting back to Dubbo and catching up with you, buddy. Oh, here we come. Doesn't want to move his own. Yeah. Maybe flop it down. It'll be okay. Yeah, there well, you go. that's guaranteed it. If there was any doubt at all, that's been taken away. So, again, Shippo can afford to be up at this head here. Well, if he moves his now, he's probably two down. But, uh, yeah, but he wants to be in there touching Jack or touching Robbie's bowl exactly yep. right. He's playing that metre. He's probably just losing his bowl in the ditch. It's yep. only, you know, two foot past the Jack. Yeah, maybe on the other hand now. Now, things we do know is we've, we've moved... Uh, greens are being in the maintenance, making sure the wear's even across the green. We've moved back towards the ditch this time, and it is pretty narrow. I, we had the roll-up yesterday... Yep. Uh, but we don't talk about that. But <laughs> <laughs> actually, it was good once you got off the ground and started going well. <laughs> yeah. yeah. All right, right Shippo. How's his... He's on an all right line here. It's just weight dependent now. Yeah. Yeah. Surprising. Didn't really give it the chance I thought he would. Yeah, the line looked aggressive. The weight wasn't. Mm. So he's down one. Robbie with another. And three all now. Yeah, Benny was... um. Getting a few in the ditch yesterday, he was. He having was. a crack at me. On the side ditches. Me, oh. <laughs> God. Yeah, and the best one was his side ditcher. <laughs> Wrong bias. We're on the ditch oh, rig there. Wrong blue. bias. He nearly did too, but he didn't have enough weight with the second. Wrong bias. That's my, didn't uh, reach the side ditch. My, my first first wrong bias for the year. <laughs> in over a year. and it, uh, Just happened to have him right in front of the commentary position. Thanks. Unbelievable. And and my skipper there, my my uh, my uh, skipper in penance is here <laughs> watching too. He's, he couldn't believe it, uh, but he was getting cranky because of the drives I was having. <laughs> anyway, enough for the roll up. It was good fun just to get out, stretch the legs. Yeah, it was. Yeah, good start here, Robbie Warren. All right, starting to find his range. He has a little bit of adjustment <laughs> needed after being on the. Benny Rousel, all the best, Dad. <laughs> Dorothy Povey goes Shibo watching while while she's at work. Excellent, Mick Anderson. I'll be I'll back Big Joe twenty five twenty. Who else we got? Jan Tyson. Yeah, brilliant. Good amount of people watching again. It's been uh, the audience of this showing the support for bowls and the bowls community over the last uh, last couple of weeks has been extraordinary. Is the only way for me to put it. It's uh, it's making me smile every day. I tell you. It's worth coming okay. to work for. Robbie now. On a good line. Just needs to reach up here. He has two great opening bowls. And as we see, crowd has just nearly doubled in size in the last 10 minutes. We've seen teams from um, the entrance, the entrance Seahawks, uh, Cabramatta, uh, Neutral Bay. So all the fours teams coming in. This is great to see. Yeah, this is important. These singles finals this morning. This is the big crowd. So this is what we're expecting with the fours turning up. It's usually a, the biggest crowd of the time, and we're using it at the uh, the end. So the last three days of this, which is Monday, isn't it? Wednesday, this all kick, this all finishes up. We're on the uh, down homeward stretch. Yes, we are. 
and I get to go home and see if my kids still recognise me and uh, <laughs> <laughs> before I head off again. Yeah, Benny, very busy boy, aren't you, mate? Yeah. Out about teaching people about Bowls Link and how to use it, members as well as administrators, and then obviously delivering the live stream for state championships and, and requested and tournaments. All, all so. sorts of other things coming up. Yeah, it's going to be great. I've got a great program coming up with Bowls. Keep an eye on our socials for, for that kind of thing. Meanwhile, he's just, just, just lost just, it a bit. He has. He's gone a bit erratic here. So, Robbie Warren definitely holding three at this stage. Gets this one close and puts some number pressure on him. Um, could be interesting. Well, he's going to come behind, but also count... Yep, that's four shots there to Robbie. Mm. It's a worry for Shippo. He needs needs to drop this one in. Oh, and he's he's skinny. But he's got better weight, so oh, that's I'm still cutting. Oh, jeez, look at that really turn out. Yeah. I knew it was skinny, but not quite that skinny. So he might have cut two out. I see Tony there with the paddles ready. Looks like he's got two ready to put up. Yep. Oh, magic fingers. Yeah, he's really good with them. Actually, Giant magic say. fingers. <laughs> really good with them too, Robbie is. I try two. it. Anything outside a foot. A bit longer than a foot, mate, and I'm hopeless. <laughs> it's like, no, <laughs> give me the tape. <laughs> so another two to Robbie. So right. three, five now. Yeah, I'm not good with them either. I understand the process. I just usually just get them out. Of it. Yeah, sorry, get the tape out. The uh, uh, what, what does Shippo call it? The lie detector. <laughs> oh, be careful there. A lot of umpires won't like you saying that. <laughs> but it does sort out who's got the shot. <laughs> yep. Well, that went in the hole. So advantage Shipley now. So let's have a look at this tactic. Okay, so Matt up. And that one has also gone all the way. Penrith ladies have just showed up as well. Yeah, I just noticed their shirts are really pretty ones. So Jack goes on the tee. Matt can go anywhere. So that's telling me that this uh, green's really dried out and the pace is back in it where it was early in the championships. Yep. So, yeah, just some adjustment needed. It's, yeah, different. Because it's definitely not breeze. Like, there's, the flags are barely moving, so... Definitely no headwind, tailwind affecting the bowls this morning. Okay, Robbie Warren, very good starter. That foot behind, a little bit more, but really good home. Yeah, flags are fluttering, but there's not, not much of an effect, I don't think. But Shippo, Oops. that's a good adjustment. Last end, he'll... Brilliant, Shippo. He'll put that out of his mind. He will. Very important for him to get back in the zone, obviously, after that somewhat erratic end. So. I think he turned his up 8-1 over there. Yeah, flying along, isn't he? Mm. So, can't quite see the play over that far over. It's the furthest rink over. Robbie, what an adjustment of weight. Warren Townie, Warren Shipley versus Robbie Warren. I knew there'd be a, have to be a champion Warren somewhere, <laughs> sometime. <laughs> so. uh, okay, Shippo just looking for a tiny adjustment of weight here as well. Is it going to run up? Yeah, not quite. But found his line again. Fiona Stewart Butcher asking where are next year's state championships. The answer is I don't know. I'm uh, out of those discussions, but uh, there's a there'll be an announcement at some point fairly soon, I think. That's above my pay grade. Yeah, I believe there's some discussions happening, so hopefully we'll find out at some stage soon. A 
Okay, shippo. It's a little, little tight here, but how's his run? If he clunks something of his own. Oh, he's got it. He's got it nicely. Pushed it all the way up. It'll so, work. Yep. Well, if he'd missed, he would have maybe finished in a similar area anyway. I think so. Maybe. It's He looks a, on a little bit of a tight line himself here. So, some good turn down that side of the green yeah, this morning. It's beautiful. Haven't seen him playing too much of the ditch side yet, so obviously worked out in their roll ups early that um, they're favouring the uh, this forehand coming back this way, backhand back the other way for right handers. So, a little bit better grass here from Shippo. Is he going to run up and count? Oh, oh he may have. Not sure. Does want to get that, that mat back, which he has. Oh, big fingers coming out again. Magic fingers. Okay, so he's picked the jacko. He's given him two. Two. All square again. I get the feeling this is going to be one of those games. You can't see it. Like, there's no... doesn't seem to be the potential for a kick away yet. Not one player's dominating, you know, and the other one getting lucky and whatnot. It just seems to be that. But I want to show you, while this jack's going down, have a look at this. You can't see the other side of the uh, barrier, but just to have a look at the camera, but have a look at the crowd here. Look at them all. And this magnificent club all the way down the back there. And all the way down the other side of the green as well, there is a multitude out there, as the uh, the old Monty Python gags say. And there's actually quite a few sitting inside the club watching the massive TV screen. Yep. Either out the window or on the screen, you see yeah, you see different layers there. You see a bunch of people facing one way and a bunch of people facing the other. Uh, probably not so much the window today because we're uh, away from it, but yeah, it's huge. Shippo's start wasn't bad. Robbie's start was better. Oh, it's dropping short on Robbie. Yeah, it doesn't count. Yep, definite one there to, to Robbie so far. Oh, is that frozen? Hmm. Got it back. Yeah, Robbie's really honing in now, isn't he? Yep. Um, Shippo's going to have to stay on his game. We saw that one erratic den end there before, but... It still did. Has it gone again? Yeah, it's frozen up again, mate. Mm, that's a worry. Someone's yeah, someone's sitting on the cable, I'd say. Yep. Damn it. Yeah, just, we'll just reset that camera for you. Oh, it might be back. It's all right. No, oh, no, it's not. Yeah, camera one. If you could reset that for me, mate, that'd be great. Shot there by uh, Shippo. Uh, sorry, Robbie. That's another one to him. I've just lost uh, that camera. So we'll get that back as soon as I can and bring you as much action as I can, as best I can. Oh, my mate, the uh, male model from McLean goes and fixes that up. Oh, zoom back in again to watch. Oh, he's kicked the jack back for two. Great shot there. Let's see what Robbie's reply is. He's come down for a look. Good timing. There's Jace there fixing the camera. Now wait for it to wake up. That might be good. So 
does not want to play the game at the moment, that little camera, so I may be running down to swap some out in a second. Oh, no, we're back. Whoa. Number one. There we go. Excuse the writing on the screen. That'll go away shortly it's just as it sets up. No. No data. Damn it. Number one. So one to uh, Wonder Warren Shipley. Looks like someone's just kicked my camera a little bit. It's not enjoying life down there. No, it's still still busted. What I might do is get you on the headset, and I'll uh, I'll run down and have a little play and see what I can fix. But uh, she's not playing the game, so I'll leave you with uh, Jason for a sec. I'll be back. Okay, I've done all the technical stuff I can possibly do, so we'll send an expert in to go and get the job done. So Shippo up six five here, and a really good opening bowl from him. He's coming down on a good track here, and he's got good weight. He's, yeah, he got a little bit of jack. Probably still one down. Shippo just asking for distances now, yep. Yeah. So going to play something a little bit similar, draw around his last. Shout out. The South Tamworth ladies have rocked in as well, so... They're all coming in. Just need another meter on that. Who else can I see out there? Lane Cove. Plenty of soldiers point ladies getting around. Foster. Okay, Robbie, is he going to... He holds up around it. Will he get back to the jack? Great bowl there, Robbie Warren. Brilliant draw bowl just around that. And pulls jack back, probably holding two shots now. And just as Warren goes to deliver, Robbie's shot bowl has flopped over, so made the target a little bit smaller. But Warren's on a very good line here. Just needs to get up. He's flopped it through. Warren Shipley, brilliant bowl. Sits the shot bowl through. and lands on top of Jack himself. Front knocker. One shot to Warren Shipley. Some big cheers and claps out there from the Soldiers Point supporters. It was a great bowl. So the Camden Rams have just rocked in as well. Okay, Robbie's just a little heavy. Just won't pull back on that side with that weight. It's got to be really precise weight there for it to come back. <clears throat> Why don't be wanting to get something probably in behind? He has got the toucher there in front, but if Robbie just cracks an egg on that, he could be holding three three shots. So something in behind the catch. Be good positional play right now. He is coming behind. Does he stay up? Just having a look out there. Yeah, he's just pulled up probably 20 centimetres short of the ditch. So Robbie's just looking to crack an egg on this, and he can make three shots. A very tight line, so this one might swing, unfortunately. Oh, oh, oh he's geez. got a result. <laughs> well, we've seen a bit of that in this game. It's Campbell. going both ways, though. So Big he made one or two. <laughs> there we so it looks like we got one camera one back. Someone was actually sitting on the cable at the other end and had a little kink in it. So I've straightened it out and moved them. 
One, Robbie Warren. There you go. So, a little bit of luck involved in this game early on, but it has gone both ways. Well, it's right, and they're playing uh, the weight to reach. Begins at the head. Luck does. Uh, number one. Oh, number one's back, baby. There she is. Poor thing. Been working hard this equipment. I'll give it a service before whatever I'm doing next. So just around the grounds, just looking. I think all the scores are on screen are also updated. Yep. yep. Looks all good out there. Splinter's coming back. 8-4. Mainline got eight one very quickly. Ten three, yep, that's correct out there. So live scores are being updated. I just got accosted by half of the Huskers and bloody club. <laughs> so walk out there. <laughs> They're all out there. Uh, morning, Dave Shaw. Green does look rapid. It is. Yep, Vince Calabrese, welcome. Sharon Setter saying, "Go, Vicky Turner." Warren just needs to push past this, just, yeah, shy. We're two foot away. Again, Ben, we're seeing both players predominantly stay on the right-hand side of this green, although, as I say that, Robbie's swapping over now. He's on it. It's funny, because I don't think... Um, Shippo's actually in his eye there on that hand, but fair enough. He's got a chance yeah, for his own. And yeah, it doesn't want to take the risk of just turning him once, so... Great ball. Yeah, what a cracker. Brilliant. So there they are. There's my Husky boys, three of them. That's Jack, Billy and Peter. I don't know where their fourth is. In here in the commentary box, mate. <laughs> <laughs> now, if they want me, I don't think I qualify for seniors, but yeah. <laughs> All right, early on we're seeing some players get out and have a roll up on green number three. The Warilla boys, Jezza Henry is out there rolling up early this morning. Yeah, he's out and he's keen too. I was just saw him uh, walking out there. He's up, up and about for this. Okay, so Robbie swapping hands here. Just drift around Shippo's short one. He's got a good area for that. They do swing back. He's coming back nicely. He's just got to get up now. Just taking that longer arc around there. You do need to give it that little bit more pace. It's travelling a further distance. Yep. Who else can I see here that I can highlight? I like showing the crowd. Everyone gets excited at home. There's uh, Tom and Sue Moore there from uh, Fig Tree and Huskisson, respectively. There's a couple of Soldiers Point lads sitting around. Shippo's got good support out there. Lots of Soldiers oh, Point. Oh, yeah. Buddy. Okay, Shippo on a good track here. Is he all the way down to the jack? Oh, looks it. He's looks got it. it. He's got it oh, beautifully. beautifully. What a great shot, Warren Shipley. Plenty of clapping out there too from the Soldiers Point crew. And my first replay of the day. It's a cracking shot. Everything in front. One little window to get through. And he absolutely nails it perfectly. Hits it fat. Brilliant. Robbie Warren coming down. Oh, it beats He's him. got an edge and gets it. <laughs> so, <laughs> what is going on? Both the guys have sort of got wry smiles on their faces. It's hard to see that in the screen, but <laughs> yeah. I think they realise there's a bit of luck. They, I said earlier, there is a bit of luck, but it's going both ways. Oh, so. that was good. I don't know if that was luck, though. That's two brilliant bowls. It's, it's good just way going up and down. Perfect, yeah. yeah. And, uh, <laughs> yeah. Oh, the lads. <laughs> Playing in good spirits. They know each other well. See, there's three Warilla guys out there, and I can't easy yet. Gets on, gets the edge of the bowl, got Didn't it. Go with it. Just got it a bit too fat, but what a great effort. Gets the edge of that. He could have actually pushed the bowl out. Jack might have moved, but his bowl would have come through as well. So. Played very decent weight to yeah, that. Most mini. definitely. It's good. Let's see if I can get around to see the Soldiers Point crews. Big Soldiers Point contingent watching. I'll just, uh, like I said, I'll just show off a little bit. Show them off and get the club showing, uh, which will because this will be up at the club, so you can 
So there we are. Here's a contingent of soldiers point bowlers. Oops, I've just had a, have a look at the camera. Happily supporting uh, their man. Long end. Another club come in. In for Earl RSM are here now. So I've just sort of been mentioned clubs as they walk in. It looks like out there on green, looks like barrel ladies over on the far yeah, yeah. side. They're definitely there. I mean, I had a, yeah. they, they took over from me after I cleared the green yesterday. And, oh, they're just super excited to be here and excited to be playing on grass. The barrel, yeah. barrel green, a um, carpet synthetic. Robbie, very good weight. Good starter. As I look around the back, it looks like young sporties. So, clubs from everywhere, everywhere. It's, it's, it's all around the state. Really great atmosphere here today. Mary Ingram from Fife in Scotland. Welcome, Roger Allen. I'm Jan from Edmonton, in, um, Alberta, Canada. Waiting for the snow to clear to play some bowls there. I think. Kind of worries. Shippo the comes down, gets the inside edge of Robbie. I think he just went a bit through, but good start of bowl. Just in behind. Steve Crick, good morning from Canberra. I hope you're not freezing over there, Gus. It's starting to get cold at night in Canberra. Well, it was a cool start here this morning, but we're going to have a fairly warm day. Actually, one thing I did notice on the way in, in the sporting fields as we drive past, is a really heavy dew. Yeah. It was pretty damp on top of everything, but no sign of it here. They've rolled it uh, pretty well, and as you were telling me, pushing the, pushing the water down... What else have we got here? Robert Benny Rouse was saying, uh, just a note before returning home, before we head off again, do you think the kids or wife will rem remember me or do you still remember my own address? <laughs> oh, it's probably going to be into my GPS, mate. Oh. I'm like, okay. oh. Shit, I narrowly <laughs> missed there. <laughs> yeah, it's probably going to be into my GPS. I'll figure it out. Yeah. <laughs> Like Robbie's line here. I was saying earlier, Benny, that the line is very weight dependent to get back. If you've got a meter on, it just does not turn at all. So that's a great shot. That is. So. And then I'm just waiting for the arrival of Aaron Tees, Actually, he should arrive with some fanfare. They'll be. Uh, they're on a flight. Uh, okay. Luke, oh, yeah, of Luke they, Jones yep. from Ballina as well is on a flight. They should be due to come in, land pretty soon. So there we go. Maitland City's out there now. Just seen DJ Dilworth. Oop. A bit of aggression there by Shippo. Went quick. Went wide though. Mm. So we think Robbie's got two here. I I, I assume so. I'm. I think the Jack Eye Bowl's usually the best one. Um, so if that, it looks close, he's on that good line again. Yeah. Maybe a bowl wider, but. As long as he's got the good weight, if he misses his and gets to that back, oh, oh, jeez, tell you what, yep. he's beaten it. He has beaten it, so well done. He probably didn't want the touch. He would have actually got to the inside more of that ball, but brilliant. Is that Lake Cargillago, Cargillago? Lake Cargillago, yeah, Cargillago. Yeah, Cargillago, that's the one. Mm -hmm. Welcome. Okay, Warren back on the draw here. Three down. Good area, but weight dependent. Not sure he'll get right back. Oh, I don't even know if he saved one. Yeah. Soon find out. Really good effort. Like, strong effort. Brave ball. Just to run down that side after pushing one a bit strange than the, the one before, a bit wide. And he's uh, he's got that one in there pretty good. So let's have it pretty well. Sorry, on, I'll just see. I'll just make sure I keep an eye on, uh, eye on the paddles. We might see a measure for the first time, not just, uh, oh, Shippo's, of course, he carries his own. <laughs> I suppose he's got a bomb bag full someone, of an umpire's kit in there. Someone told me he's got a little bit of elastic on the end of his, eh? <laughs> <laughs> now, I don't want to use yours, use mine, use mine. <laughs> no, not at all. We just like to have fun with Shippo, as everyone does across the state. He's a character. And two. Well, that surprises me, actually. Yeah, so he did cut one out. I think it was three before that. Mm -hmm. 
So three ends in a row now to uh, Robbie Warren. He's done that a couple of times. So the first three ends went to Shippo. The next three went to Robbie. Two after that to to Shippo, and then th- the next three to Robbie. Uh, so by that trend, Shippo will win this one. Now that one's going to the ditch again. Doing that a bit, chasing that long end. He's throwing the uh, yeah, Jack in the ditch, and Shippo bringing the mat right up. Clever. He's seen what uh, seen what his opponent's doing. It's great to see our live scores have been updated exactly as per the boards out there. So good work by our volunteers. Look at the crowd. One, two, three, four deep at the back here. Two, yeah. two to three deep at the, on the side, and then they're lining the uh, the shady side under the signs across the other side. It is, and then you've got teams out on green rolling up. Yeah, <laughs> the, they're down the bottom too. Yep, very busy Monday morning here. Is Monday? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> I was, <laughs> Sorry, I was just thinking the same thing as a Monday. Yeah. It's got that weekend atmosphere. <laughs> so what's going on here? Oh, he's checking the length. What do you reckon? Bets on? Oh, that's easy in. That's in by two metres. Let's have a look. So, Jack's up about, I'm going to say, two and a half metres. Just trying to look at the mark along the bank. It's, it's close. I think it's in. Oh, I reckon it's in by a long way. Okay, Benny's going. It's in by a long way. And I'm saying it's just in. So, let's see. Here comes the... Uh, Best looking up on the business, yep, metre and a half. Benny K, all over it. Hey, all over it. <laughs> That's because I was looking at the number on the rink. I didn't see <laughs> the rink number is the 21 yeah. metre mark. I just found the, the white mark on the edge of the bank up there. Yeah, so yeah, Understood, mate. That's <laughs> the 21 metres, yep. So who's that all over right. there just turning up now? Really cool uniforms, red and white. I know there's so many. Like, I'm loving watching these teams rocking yeah, him. It's really cool. It's the colours and I haven't seen before. It's, it, it is um, quite, it's just like a parade at the moment. Yeah. <laughs> a parade of colour. It's beautiful. Okay. Let's see how this length, change of length um, goes. Warren Shipley straight on it. Obviously, it's a favoured. <laughs> Sorry, Scott Thorogood, good. You should see Shippo's bowls bag: shampoo, conditioner, brill cream, moisturiser, fake eyelashes. Oh, no, <laughs> no way. I wonder what Absolutely. he's going to think. I wonder if he'll watch this back. Oh, we don't lose. Not. He'll look at the comments. <laughs> yeah, uh, Ron official. They're watching at the big screen at Taraji Bolo. Come on, Robbie. Yep, good on you. Hi everyone at Taraji. Hope you're enjoying the coverage. Uh, I haven't got their club name on the back. Can't quite tell where they're from. Yeah, the red and white ones are cool. But uh, Robert, uh, sorry, what's his name? <laughs> Warren's just got a really good ball there and another to follow it up. Yeah, so Warren's liking these shorter lengths. We can see that straight away. Robbie would be, should we look at a push Shippo through or drag the jack? Just playing that at least a foot on. Ooh. He bowled out a turn is the word I've just gotten. So it was... Yeah, so Robbie Warren did win the last end. And Shippo... No, no Cause, Robbie cause bowled he th first. Yeah, he threw the, threw the jack in the ditch. So it was Robbie's end. I'll just make sure I'll check that. Six, nine... No, so it was, it was Shippo's end. What's going on there? Have I got an extra end in? Six nine on the scoreboard down there. Six ten on mine. I'll I'll copy what they've got. Oh yeah, because I put three there. Ah yes, it was a measure of three, wasn't it? Yeah, only got two. That's right. Robbie Warren coming down. Oh, got that bowl a bit too much. Wanted more the inside edge or Warren's bowl. So I think he's only sitting for one here. Shippo is. Yeah, no, there was no out of turn. It was just that the yeah, jack right, was yeah. thrown in the ditch. Yeah, that's right. Phil got it right. Uh, Nick Hardy, let's go, Robbie. Wat watching from the club. Tim Yell from Yugara. Go, Shippo. So, one to Shippo. That's what I said. The trend.
friend. <laughs> Stats never lie. Rubbish. <laughs> Seven nine. Tight game. Yeah. Shippo straight back to that short length again. Across the greens, yeah. Scores are all updated as per the boards. Good to see. Yeah, they're doing well. Um, yeah, you and I are just doing the same thing. It's just. There's so much going on. There is. <laughs> We're both just looking around everywhere, not talking. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, look, Warren Shipley, great bowl. Yeah, it's just uh, there's so much colour out here at the moment. All the all the uniforms, all Love the uh, all the people sitting around watching the bowls. We're having a roll-up. Club Dubbo putting on a show once again. They've been doing it for a few it's weeks. Robbie. Robbie's going to get back. Hold on. Yeah, Drew. Yeah, he's got the shot. Mm -hmm. Just through the gap. I haven't seen a worry, Robbie Warren aggressive shot yet. I'm looking forward to a to a clunk. Yeah, seeing one of those, and he can really let him go. Maybe it's because Shippo hasn't gotten close enough. <laughs> <laughs> no, not at all. Not at all. No, he's played play well. Look, seven nine against yeah. Robbie Warren. He's a, he hasn't really needed to. Look, look at this. That's a great shot. We'll see a little bit of a reaching weight here. Just think he's gone a little bit high with his line. So, well, just over the draw weight, but he's got himself too backwards. So now it's time for Shippo to have a think about tactics. Where does he want to go with his third? Does he turn his own up? Get one around the back? No, and Robbie will be aggressive. Well, she was just, yeah, he's just trying to build again here, I think. I reckon he he's not too fussed about it. Turns that over. Yeah. But well, you've asked for a heavy shot. It's a little bit of a target there, but he can still get it on the forehand. Oh, definitely. Nah, he's lining up. I don't think he's lining up massive. He's well, yeah, it's not, playing, not giant. No, he's just playing a heavy weight into there. Try and move something around. Oh, Warren geez. gives himself a plug. You should know better. Warren Shipley, get out of my camera view. Warren Shipley, <laughs> just giving himself and his club a plug there. So. What the heck? <laughs> There's one player on that green that should know better at him. Unbelievable. Uh, he's, he's <laughs> seizing the opportunity, what? mate. Oh. <laughs> no, I'm not going to show you. This is going to be a great shot, but you're not going to see it. <laughs> So, what's the result there? We've oh, I don't know. He's got one. Can't quite tell. <laughs> Distances are hard to see on screen. <laughs> I can't believe he did that. That's, that's pretty funny. Sort of favour in the front blue, but... Let's see. I like Shippo's yeah, line here. this one. If he moves Jack, he'll be extremely happy. Any movement of Jack would be brilliant. He's drawn the shot and just nailed it anyway. So he's definitely got one. We're not sure about the second. Question now being asked, yeah. in fact. It is only one just down. One yet. So I think Robbie will just be staying on the draw here. <laughs> Phil means his best view. Not the back of him. He needs to come back. He's just a little... If he sits him... No, he hasn't. He's run past. Just, just run past. Through. Wow. <laughs> Good effort. Yep. So another one to Warren Shipley. And if this trend continues, he'll get the next one, and then Robbie will get the one after that. Yay, stats. Walking all the way up. Look at that. Up yep. the line. Sticking with this length, he's got a little bit of a run now, so... It doesn't, don't know if Robbie winds up, don't blink, you miss it. That's why I have replays, mate. Susan Tura watching. Beautiful. 
Beautiful. I just can't believe the amount of people here. This is so Brilliant. good. This is so good. All right, Shippo. Just runs up. Yeah. Yep, well done, Shippo. Good start. Vicky Turner's kicked away, 14-5 over there. Yeah, she has, hasn't she? A lot of people supporting uh, both Robbie and, and uh, Vicky at the moment, just wanting the um, two trophies to go to the Illawarra. Robbie just through there. Yeah, and Maylene's got a mini gap now, 14-8. Yep. She's a bit of a... Uh, people's choice, I guess you could yeah, say. She's, she's got the cult. <laughs> she's definitely got the cult following. A lot of people are going to be cheering her on. Yeah, I but actually got a chance to watch, and she was, and she even said it was really bad in her very first sectional game. She was down by twenty shots. I was able to get back to thirteen, so shot. cut yep. margin down. But then she won her next two games and got through a margin in a section. So great to see her out there. Robbie on a slightly tighter line this time. Is he going to come all the way back to the jack? It is. It is. He's got this He's got really it. well and stayed with it. Did too. Yep. You asked the question and he, he answered. See a bit of a fire over the back there too. Only a little one. Might just be a burn off. Yep. Just seeing smoke in the air. It makes me oh, nervous. Yeah. Been a <laughs> South Coast boy. We don't like seeing smoke in the air at the moment. We're all a bit, still a bit traumatised down there. Okay, so Shippo will be wanting to sit on Robbie here. He can actually just draw to him. Sit him through a little bit and stay for three. And he's very close. He needs to turn. Well, he's got him through. So he nailed that. three that's, shots to Shippo. That's brilliant. That's a brilliant shot, Warren Shipley. Applause. I can actually hear the applause going out there. That was good. Yeah. A little bit of pressure on here. Robbie wants to get one in now. He's on a very good track. We know they're coming home from there. Look at it. Oh. Look at this. Does it push up? Oh, Ooh. I don't know. I'm not sure. I suppose he's coming down and have a look. Because he might be choosing now to, to hit and sit. Looking out the window, out. I'm thinking Shippo's back. It's And it's, de it's quite um, deceptive on screen, but... It's his back bowl that looks closest. You see out the window there, the hedge, yeah. hedge is in my way, but yeah. Yeah, it's his back bowl that's that. So that back bowl is actually only one bowl behind Jack. Mm. I'm favouring Robbie for shot. So Shippo can just promote either one of those front bowls of his, or if he's under. No, he's and going under. He's aiming at it. Under and sits that right through. Gets the inside edge. Warren Shipley, what oh, a shot. brilliant bowl. He aimed at that. He was dead set. Thinks, I'm going to get rid of that. He's definitely got one. I've shot. Favour him for... I oh, he's got four. Yeah. Just watch this again. He dead set went under the line at a weight just to move Robbie through. And got it perfectly on the inside edge. Just that's Just precision. Brilliant bowling. So, yeah, he's four there. Well, just having a look. He could be. So, Robbie Warren. Okay, Benny. Here it comes. He's good fly flying around his <laughs> noggin. Here we go again. Shippo's actually standing off to the side here having a chat to some people down yes. He's, so he's, of water. he's actually telling everyone, get out of the road. <laughs> but let's see how hard he does go. So there we go. It's quick. And he's oh, he's cleared out two of them. Well, he got two out. Played a nice aggressive shot there. I've seen him, I saw a couple the other day a lot quicker than that, but he's obviously trying for the control, knowing that's the also the uh, tighter side. He's rolled the one out. Magic fingers. 
rag in hand as well. Yeah, so he's given him two. So it was four shots he was holding. So well done, Robbie Warren, getting a couple out there. Sid. Limiting the damage. Well, Shippo's ahead now after putting the last three ends. And once again, I'll just point this out. 1-1-1 one, one, one in the first three ends. 2-1-2 two, two in the next three. 2-1 and then 1-1-2 one, one, and then 1-1-2 one, one, in opposite directions. So statistically, looking at the trend, Robbie Warren will win this. <laughs> <laughs> just, just looking at the trends, it's really quite remarkable, the symmetry in this at the moment. So, uh, again, just for stats, not that it matters. We're up to the 14th end, 9, well, 10 9 now to Warren Shipley. Yeah, good opening bowl there by Warren. He's really found his range with his early bowls he has the last few, and since he's gone to this shorter mat up, shorter jack, shorter length, he's come back into his own with his early bowls, which is really important in setting up the end. Somewhat, um, yeah, exactly right. How's that breeze going? Yeah, there's nothing, nothing to speak of still. Um, predictions were pretty pretty firm on the lack of wind today. There's ship out. Down pretty well again here, Shippo. Just his weight now. And he's run up nicely. Yeah, good two shots, Shippo. Dylan Essex at uh, Milton Aladulla Blue Fins. And then new, new shirt, actually, but he always wears that goofy hat. That's how I know he's there. <laughs> okay, Robbie down better this time. Is he going to run right up? Inside edge of that yeah. flop. Good bowl. One back to Robbie. So, as we see again, the guys are really favouring this left-hand side. As looking at the screen, it's an aggressive line. So I think Shippo might just be trying to push through here, sit Robbie through, and stay. It took some, would have taken oh. some confidence the last time we did that. It was a little... Well, really, in the end, it was just draw weight. Yeah. I thought straight away with the line that he was you know, pushing a metre through at least. Well, he's got the two options on that way. Yeah. So he's only a foot past Jack or uh, Robbie's bowl. And Robbie on a Rob actually pretty similar line, he I is. thought. Is he up now? He is. Yeah. Two. He's got, he has got two, so... Well, she plays Nick last bolt. Let's see, just could almost be the same. True. Just a little wider. Just put a little more, more width on it. It's quicker. Well, very aggressive line here. A lot quicker. What's he going to do? We've seen a lot of. Well, I was going to say if he edged his own, he'd be happy, but he didn't. Definitely two down there. Free kick here for Robbie Warren. It is a free kick. What did I say? <laughs> I said he'd win this end, didn't I? He did, actually. Yeah. <laughs> uh, well, the end isn't, isn't completed yet, so... <laughs> <laughs> and statistically, it'll be a two. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yep. So, Benny's data trends are... On, on point. On point, all right. New leader. Yeah, good, very good bowling. Who's that? Mark Jones watching from Bali. <laughs> Darren Papers, Trafus said that Robbie Warren drive was half pace. Yeah, uh, yeah. Benny Russell, not bad for an old man. Yep. Schmacko, shot. What have we got? Lots of love. Oh, jeez. Sorry. I let myself down. <laughs> He's run. He's aggressive shot. <laughs> Johnny Green asking what for watching from Hong Kong, what's the pace? I'm going to say uh, 15, 16. Yeah, it is. It's actually quite good this morning, Johnny. Yep. You know, um, I'm thinking it's a good, solid 14, uh, 14 and a half, looking at it. I've got a green keeper behind me. What is it? 
<laughs> He's the only the assistant he said so. <laughs> but definitely it's uh yeah the the pace this morning's probably quicker than what it's been for a little while. I oh, just water's coming out of it now. Yeah, it's dried out. So uh Robbie with a good start. Shippo's gonna be short here. Changing back to a, a longer end. Yeah, good bowl in there, Robbie. Yep. Great weight with his first two bowls. high this time so let's really let Warren, uh, Robbie in here to really nail Jack and put some number pressure on yeah I reckon on Shippo so just questions here on YouTube which I've been ignoring sorry Snoopy only use YouTube as social do you put the program up on that put a program up on that format no but maybe we should that's something I'll keep in mind mate we'll put a, uh, a short video up to let you know what's going on thanks for that suggestion and I think uh, Junior's at Warilla is likely to be the next space I go. So that's 15th to 19th. 99 of the uh, state's best juniors popping up. It's a big number. 33 girls. It's going to be great. Uh, ships Ahoy. Oh. Paul Sargent. G'day from Cornwall. Yeah, we're playing uh, playing shots. 25 shots is the winning. And, yeah, interesting. You can like the, like the stream on you, on YouTube as well, everyone. So it's a bit of a scattered head, this one. Yeah, probably holding three, though. That's Yeah, he is. And that's pretty... Right, just looking... Probably yeah. scattered for Shippo, obviously. Very scattered. He's done that, he's done that before and, on this end. And back this and way. back this way, yep. yep. Who's that? That's, that's bright blue. Foster. And that's Foster turning up. Sharkies. Yeah, Shannon White and Dom Riley. Well, it's better put a fourth one in here and put the pressure on Warren Shippen. Really like to get onto that, Jack. Well, it's a fair effort. It is a fair effort. Four shots. Serious looking mob, aren't they, Foster, walking through? <laughs> Not a smile on their faces. Okay, Shippo, just... I'm going to cut the count here. Well, Robbie's bowl has fallen over. I wonder if that will assist Shippo in getting... Inside, well, he was out around it anyway. Gets off of that and flops yeah. down. Didn't flop, but that's a good shot. That's a very good shot. Yeah, what? I think. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I was about to say, I'm just looking. It's more Jack Eye than, uh, than Robbie. It so is. He may have he rescued this got in a big way. He might have nearly snuck shot there. So, four down on the head. Even if he's only one down, it's a brilliant bowl. One yellow one. So, well, Shippo's having a look. Yep, one <laughs> Yeah. So, the marker declared it before Shippo got to look at it as well. <laughs> He's probably just gone, Shippo, you're wrong. <laughs> I'm going. <laughs> All right. So, we're back 12.10 now. The other scores, the big fight back there in the senior ladies. Wendy Clark was down 14-6, I believe. Felt like that. Yeah, I think so. Back to 14-11, so... 14-12 I've actually got here on the on my little board. Oh, okay, yeah, sorry, I'm only looking so at maybe the scoreboard. That, yeah, maybe that not good kick And out. out there on green, I'm looking, she's got shot about two bowls short of Jack. So, Wendy making a fight back. That's it, and I'm looking at the uh, Maylene's score. She's just dropped one there, but uh, so 18 9 now. Um, Splinter just bringing the mat right up and trying to change things up by the looks. So, all happening around here. Three brilliant singles finals after, well, let's talk about yesterday, shall we? Actually, before I do oh. that, I'm just going to pop, pop this on the screen because it's there. Yep. 
uh, the like and share promotion. Don't forget to like and share. Every stream, you're running out of time, guys, to do this. Every stream, like it, share it, send it out. You'll get some uh, cool prizes, over $5,000 worth of prizes in partnership with Sharp EIT Solutions. Uh, terms and conditions apply on the Bowls New South Wales website. Jason's just jumped up and done it himself. 70-inch uh, Android, 40-inch smart touchscreen, high-speed printer and a couple of microwaves. So thanks to Sharp EIT Solutions. Get on there, like and share. Oh, wow. That rhymed, actually. There you go. I've just come up with a new slogan. Robbie Holding. Yeah, Shippo's down really well here, though. Yep, but Shippo just drawing the absolute. Look at that. Barbara Green. Robbie Warren moves like a dancer. So graceful. <laughs> I like that. Yeah. Yeah. How will I know when I win the TV? You'll get a message. Essentially, it's all in the terms and conditions. Have a look. The uh, closes uh, Wednesday midnight. Yeah, go to the Bowls New South Wales website and you'll see the terms and conditions for the competition on there. Wanting this to push up a little bit more. He's yeah, a little bit shy, so he's he's got one. Robbie has the next best two. He's coming up to have a look at distances here. Have a look at yeah, he's he's trying he's looking down underneath his <laughs> bowl there on the left, seeing if he'll swoop back to Jack. That was funny, he was actually asking Shippo if she go she if he should go down that way. <laughs> <laughs> bit of banner amongst the fellas. They're, they're obviously good mates. They yeah. would have known each other. They've both been playing bowls for a long time. Would have come across each other quite a fair bit yeah. through tournaments and state championship stuff, pennants probably even. So I know I've done that with when you play against some mates and they're at the head. <laughs> Ask them to call you a shot. <laughs> That's it. Let me know what you think. Yeah. <laughs> Most of the time it's uh, yeah, side ditcher. <laughs> oh, I'll do the Benny K shot. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> You're exactly right. Sorry, bud. <laughs> no, nope, it's fair. It's fair I did it. We can't argue. Here comes Robbie. So, Shippo, Shippo advertising his club very well again. Oh, he's missed it all. Yeah. So, she's a pretty... I was going to say a free kick, but if you're, if you're an AFL uh, supporter, you'd understand this is like a free kick in the forward pocket and you've got a banana in and he's got risk everywhere and uh, I'm thinking he's happy with one here he's going to play it if he, he gets to the safe, outside so. bowl inside he wants to get to the outside bowl and flops it's probably the best but he doesn't want to be inside of that doesn't want contact on his own it's an interesting line very interesting line oh look at this off of that onto that Oh, great shot. Great shot, Warren Shipley. <laughs> that was beautiful. I thought, he was a, I thought he was a tad aggressive there. <laughs> Expected more draw weight. but Made me nervous, so I think he's got two. He must be confident, the he boys. 12 all. Good game on our hands here. Hope the viewers out there are liking it. Yep, well, look. If you're coming back after yesterday, you saw Dawny E. Heyman win her 21st game in a row and take the state singles, women's singles championship. And then that game in, in the afternoon in the men's, I was uh, not commentating that one. I was sitting in the house watching it on YouTube and uh, on the big screen at home at the house. And, mate, Jay Bruce and, like, Mark played an amazing oh. game. And then Jay Bruce just grabbed the jack, went long, and didn't lose an end. He just was perfect right to the end. It was brilliant. A great game of bowls. Do yourself a favour. It's not going to be deleted from the Facebook or YouTube. Orange Go back and watch Shipley. it. Again. Great opening yeah. bowl. Well, well, who are the crabs there? Yeah, Gwendolyn. Gwend the Gwendolyn crabs have rocked in. I like that shirt. I want to get one They're of those. Really nice shirt, aren't they? Yeah. Most definitely. I'm actually planning my trips around the shirts I want now. I think. <laughs> <laughs>
Where's Gwandalum? I don't even know where Gwandalum is. Central Coast, zone 15. Oh, righto. Yep. Yep. Okay, Shippo down well again. Oof. Oh, just misses. Finishes in a good home. Robbie out on a really good line. They are sweeping home from there. Will he get back far enough? Well, that's Great a very bowl. good second. It's a brilliant bowl. Setting the head up well for himself. Kind of for his next. Shippo will just be wanting to draw down onto Robbie's last bowl there. It's about two bowls behind Jack. <laughs> I think Gus just saying buying the shirts is an expensive hobby. Yeah, it really is, mate. <laughs> um, Shippo down, gets the jack. It's a very good bowl. He's trailed it away, made it harder now for Robbie to get to. I think it could be two down now, Robbie Warren. So... Terry Long saying there's sound keeps cutting out every now and again. Screen goes fuzzy. Let me know if that's happening to everyone. I've got a monitor on this, and it's not happening to me. But uh, let us know. Honestly, Terry, if it's regular every few seconds, and it sounds like a radar. It does. It sounds like radar interference. So it's interesting. You, yeah, I know Soldiers Point's pretty close to um to Williamtown Air Base. So yeah, Robbie playing with a bit of aggression down that forehand side. Just hung out. See Warren's just coming up to have a look, probably to determine if he's got one or two and see where he wants to get another bowl exactly. Yeah. Steve Winter, great coverage and commentary. Thanks, Steve. Love that. Uh, Doreen Dixon watching from Ulladulla. I need Doreen, one of my favourite people. Has a pretty good son too. He goes all right. <laughs> good oh, kids. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Tone down a little. <laughs> 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 okay, giving the man two wraps, too many wraps. <laughs> uh, Dean Andrews watching from Marupna, loves it, yep, as you do. Steve trying to figure out where to put that big TV when he wins it. Uh, Heidi Finley, mate, you're more than welcome. We do our best and uh, we love doing it too. It's great fun. Also, here we go, N the uh, Narandra Redbacks are in town now as well. Shippo, yeah, he was looking to sit that through and stay, so I reckon Well It's an aggressive line, but it's not a Robbie Warren cracker However, he's pretty he's close he's to the line, he wants to miss that. his own Oh, it rolls on So Close Might only be one shot here, but we'll soon find out it is just the one. And again, new leader. It's funny, yesterday, Benny, <laughs> we got Andrew Lynn early in that game and he's made a call early on in the game saying, oh, we have a new leader and it was actually a draw. <laughs> Me and Lee had a lot of fun with that during, during the streams. <laughs> we went, Andrew Lynn's wrong? What? <laughs> no. Well, he said, <laughs> so. Technically, he would have been out as... No, he, oh, he, found he, the regulation he, twist, for that, he twisted it so that it sounded like he wasn't wrong. But <laughs> no, we love Andrew, mate. He really makes an error. Our Andrew Lynn, he's oh. a legend. Legend of the sport in New South what Wales. Now, what's he, what's he at, 26 years, 28 years, I think, for uh, Bowls New South Wales? Don't know. In, in himself, all its forms over history? Watching him this morning, working. Obviously, on the champion of champions stuff, he's got the two screens up and he's swapping between screens. He's a bit of a master at his art. Yeah, he so. it, it is an art form at times too. Oh, what he does, so. his uh, his knowledge of Excel formulas and that is, oh, is brilliant. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just... I've learned a lot in these couple of weeks, actually, <laughs> um, sitting down, uh, just chatting with him. So well, that's Would a good shot, Robbie. Trend says he should win this. So, uh, <laughs> Here we go. No predictions this time because the the, the uh, trends are getting shorter. So we'll see. Excuse me a sec. I'm just going to run off for a comfort break, Jase. All yours. Not a worry, mate. Joy. Okay, Warren. Is he going to get back enough? He just just a little bit over, but he's finishing a good home. Wanted to give it a chance after his first one being meter short. 
Didn't want to do that again, so chance here for Robbie to put some pressure on, get right on this Jack. Needs to just come across a little bit harder. Yeah, very, very good bowl there, just in behind. Didn't sort of fatten the target for Shippo to look at either, so. He still will be looking to draw to that bowl. And he's on a good line here, he's just got to hold on. Oh, he's found the gap and just through, so. Okay, so we're looking outside the open reserves. Marlene's on 24. It's 24-9. So she's really knuckled down this morning and taken no prisoners. As I look out there, she's actually holding shot on this head. Yeah, so she does have shot and it's about a foot short of the jack. Camera matter up with two bowls to go. Marlene with just one. Currently Marlene holding game. I know there's some Marlene fans out there online, so trying to bring it to you. Shippo just shooting through, so stats don't lie. <laughs> Kick here for Robbie. Can he draw for three though? The stats have been saying two. And Benny's got two up, so let's try and blow his stats out of the board here, Robbie. And he's on a good track. Just Got to run up a little bit more. I think he's good enough. I like him for three, but... <laughs> I think you're hoping. <laughs> I've been wrong so many times. <laughs> Marlene, with her last bowl, just drawn one about six inches behind nope. Jack. Last bowl for Cabramatta. Marlene holding game. He's lining up. There's weight being played. You can see it on the left-hand side of our screen. He's oh, he's gone. Turn and shaking hands. Marlene Reynolds, congratulations. State Open Reserve Singles Champion. Marlene Reynolds from NBC Sports. Congratulations, sir. NBC Sports will be going off. There's a great little community out there uh, at that wonderful club. And well done. Congratulations to Marlene. Yeah. I didn't see what that was. Where's Did the paddles? Two. Two. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> just sorry, just trying to bring uh, the result of the uh, open reserves to you. Um. <laughs> now, well done, Marlene. That's exciting. She's a, um, a a character and a and as you said, clubhouse favourite. Yes, so she she's is. A, yeah, yeah. Well done, so the senior women's singles. What a turn up! We're back to fifteen all. Wendy Clark has really knuckled down. Maybe some early nerves. Not sure. But the scoreboard back to 15 all now. So I think the Ballina Club, I'm sure they'll have... Hoping they've got this on their screens yeah. up there and following the live score. Louise Clemens, great bowling show. We're watching from Gloucester. Gloucester? Oh, I can't say that word. Gloucester. Gloucester. There we go. Yep. Uh, Mark Conway all cheering. Uh, Warren, which one? It's <laughs> one, two. <laughs> yeah. uh, Mark got it. Go, Vic. Lane Cove Larrankins yeah. are raring to go. They are here. Yeah, lots of people on this. Lots of people on uh, Facebook here saying, well done, uh, Marlene. <laughs> <laughs> I love that one. <laughs> Harley Ryan. Uh, Warren must be getting older. Won the club triples with him 44 years ago at West Wall's End. <laughs> <laughs> oh, uh, yeah, he was bowling back when... Uh, it's a popular character, our Warren Shipley. He is. <laughs> okay, he's got a good line here. Just under, but good set up. Two shots. Let's see, this time in this direction. Robbie's just been a bit erratic, so... Can Robbie adjust here and... Yeah, he's done well. Oh, it's 
pretty close, actually. I think that because he's a bit straighter, I think he'll have it. They're, they're a about favor. even at the back. I favour Robbie's bowl, but... Yeah, it's a measure. Yeah, it's it's definitely cool. a measure. Just standing up and having a look out the window there. It's like me and Lee yesterday on the last end of... Uh, Oh, Southwest Rocks Ospreys. Yeah. <laughs> Gee, that's a flash of it too. I just yeah. noticed that walking down. Orange and blue and white. Yeah. I like that. Shippo. Has he got the run? Oh, not quite. No, not quite. Good line. There's an odd one over there too, a Moama Steamers shirt. Obviously they play, while well, they're in New South Wales, they play in Victoria. One of the great clubs in the country, Moama. That's a BPL uh, place run by Kevin Anderson and Stewie White down there. Okay, Robbie out here wanting to beat Shippo's bowl here. Not sure if he's got the run. Once again, that side, because it's that bigger arc, bigger trajectory, goes over a longer distance. You've just got to give it that little bit of extra weight so it can run out over that distance. No. <laughs> Peter saying nice things. Just want to say well done in commentary to Jace. Benny Two Shoes and Andrew uh, made the fantastic bowls enjoyable from Yambo and Devon Heads. Thanks, mate. I appreciate oh, yeah, them very Devin much. Devon Heads. Yeah. That's another nickname I've got, Devon Head. Devin. <laughs> like, oh, <mate. laughs> I'm just here to entertain the crowd. <laughs> just collecting nicknames all over the place. <laughs> Good idea, mate. Yeah, no, thanks, Pete. Really appreciate that uh, nickname going public, mate. <laughs> Would have been nice to stay on the North Coast. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, a lot of congratulations coming in from Ma here. So, uh, that's yeah, and well deserved too. So she got off to a slow start, section one, so game one in a section. When she's finished getting hugs out there, I actually might see if I can grab her and bring her in for a chat. Yeah, it'd be great to have a quick chat with her, obviously. Let's go and have a word with Stinson right now and see. Yeah. All right, so we'll find out who's got shot here. Oh, I favoured the blue, but it is up and down. So, gonna be wanting, yeah. So it's gonna be wanting a measure here. Well, the tape measure. Carl Healy just wandering on in. Legend. One blue one, which is one Shipley bowl. That's against trend. There you go. I told you they were getting smaller. 14 all. Hang on. New leader. <laughs> no, that's good. 14 all now between these two senior singles. Uh, man, it's a slow process to get to the race to that 25. But, uh, geez, they're doing very well. Some really good bowls coming down here. Very enjoyable. Alan Law, plenty of life left in old ship. Uh, thanks, Law Man. Loving the feedback everyone's giving us. It's great. And uh, just can't tell you how much fun this is at times. It's uh, especially when you get games like this in front of you. It's been a occasional hard slog to get here. We've got the fours coming up uh, this, later on, which is fairly soon. I'm not sure what time they're due to start, actually, but... 1 p.m. So we do this and then some lunch and then we're off, uh, kicking off for the with the fours. In our last format of the 2023-24 Bowls New South Wales State Championships brought to you from uh, Club Dubbo here, as well as uh, North Dubbo, RSL Sporties and Macquarie Club, three brilliant clubs here in the Dubbo region and heavily supported by the Dubbo Regional Council. They've been magnificent to us. Uh, and... Uh, what a place to be. I'll come back out here for another trip. Well, I'm coming out not just for the bowls either, but for everything else that goes on. Bring your kids out to the zoo and or come out yourself. Uh, wet, yeah, the Taronga Western Open Plain Zoo and the... Actually, I still haven't done the Royal Flying Doctor's visitor, visitor experience. I should try to find time for that. Uh, what else is there? Uh, oh, the prison is brilliant. Go and check that out. Uh, the story of it's really rad. Ghost tours, which I yeah, get reminded by uh, Lee Stintz in the background here. Yeah, I went on one of those myself. And, uh, yeah, it's been great. Dubbo Regional Council. Just jump on to dubboregion.com.au for more information. 
So, Shibo holding one there at the front is the word. A riot of colour out here with the amount of uniforms. There's a lot of Northmead people there. Uh, I'm trying to get Ma in for a little chat, but she may not make it up. She's out there signing autographs by the looks of it. Speaking of autographs, Jimmy McRory or the Warilla people, he's over there. He's set up stationed at a table. He's drinking water this morning, so jump up and uh, ask him for an autograph. He'll make his day, I promise. I expect to see a queue out there at some point. So Robbie Warren looking to match up Shippo, and he has. What a great shot, crossing, bouncing across and uh, sitting right next to Jack. Great result. Yeah, watching from Camden. So this game is very close. If you haven't heard, there's a measure happening over there, but if you haven't heard, Marlene uh, Reynolds from MBC Sports has won the Open Reserve Singles Final and is our latest state champion. Two more to be crowned this morning. This senior men's game between Warren Shipley and Robbie Warren is going down to the wire. So it won there to uh, one there to Robbie Warren. Reaches 15. 10 to go for Robbie Warren. 11 to go for Warren Shipley. And these boys are just like old uh, old boxers, just punch for punch at the moment. Greg Hodge from them bucket bucketheads enjoying it. Yeah, thanks, mate. Appreciate that very much. Now at fourteen fifteen, the way this is progressing, no real uh, big scores. I'm just looking at through there. It's been ones and twos the whole way. There are no threes. These gentlemen are either very good at drawing shot and very good at rescuing at the same time. So. Uh, an amazing little effort. What we got? There's a few people moving behind the head, the head there, and uh, Robbie just telling them to get the heck out of the way. Or telling them to stop. Yep. And crossing now. No, no one's trying to bowl. Pretty insistent on that too. We go down here. Neutral bays just turn up as well. All the shirts, all the club uniforms around is just brilliant to see. I'm loving this so much. It's like a parade. Well, Shippo is pretty close. He's going to cross. It depends on where this stops. Uh, Robbie's still holding one. Great weight. Both both of these gentlemen. Look at that. Right on the line. Pretty good line. <laughs> and little door oh, just wanted to avoid a touch on Jack. He was close. Kicking Jack uh, sideways with a square cut would have been painful. Good game going on here, isn't there? Brilliant game. Well, Ma's not coming up because she's talking to Trish. <laughs> the interview's done. But, uh... Here we go. Shippo. Just, oh, I got a little slice of Jack. <laughs> and ran through a little. It's close. Very close. That's a better, better line, I think, from Wobby. Robbie. <laughs> so it was Wobby. <laughs> Wobby. Wobby Warren. Okay. Lots but of words. So, Shippo here, swapping hands. If he comes down a little tight, he can sit Robbie through and stay for three here. And it looks like that's what he's sort of playing for with that line. We saw him play one down here similar once before. 
Shippo very close. He's just got to hold to the bowl now. He has. Oh, wow. Warren Shipley, come on down. I'm going to replay <laughs> that one. As soon as I'll just rob his... Uh, Wasted no time on the mat. He's really found that well. That's the second time he's played that little weighted shot down that forehand. Across the head. Back yeah. this way across the head. And twice he's got the ideal result. But oh, looking for Jack. Okay. Free Let's have a look at... Free yeah, free kick. Sorry, yeah, I'm going to say, watch this one again. So this is the replay of uh, of the last shot. Weighted, beautiful line just, just on the... Uh, very much on the narrow side, but this is exactly what he was aiming at. Cross the head and punch that bowl out for three. His last bowl's on its way. Last bowl coming down. He just needs to land in there. And, and, he, and he will. He has full count to Warren Shipley, so... Brilliant bowl. A little bit of a break there. That what a takes bowl. the lead. Three shots <laughs> lead now. Yeah, sensational. That'll be on the highlights reel tonight. Another new leader. The lead changes again, but for the first time we've seen something uh, over a two. It's a full count, and uh, he's jumped to the jumped into the lead, biggest lead of the match. Three shots. Yeah, and straight away, Matt up. Yeah, some life left in the old dog, isn't there? <laughs> it's funny how they call him an old dog and he's no, just he's broken into the senior ranks. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Tracy Dawson said she's watching while Cobby cutting Bobby Arnold's hair. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> <laughs> Big run by Shippo, Jake Maloney said. Uh, that's flat out for Woz. I think I might block that word. I can actually put a filter on that word. Restricted. <laughs> Hey, we hustle, big finish, Dad. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Love it, Benny. Now, Robbie Warren with just dropping one in front, pretty close, holding the shot for now. In the after the first two balls, okay, Warren just will come home from there. Is he going to pull up though? Just a little through, but he's got a really good position. He has. Yeah. as well, just ducking around the back. So it went, I said at the start, the stats said threes, three ends each for until the 14th end, and then it was two ends each for, till the 18th. And now it's end for end, and the difference being that uh, Shippo managed to get a four. He's just got to run this line. He's just, well, yeah, he's through. He's got underneath. Yeah. Back to order. Warren Shipley holding shot. Put, not giving anything away to Robbie to make it easy for him. Ma's still down there. She hasn't come up yet. Robbie's really interested in this, he is. If he gets under that... Yeah, look at this. He's played a good weight, got the inside of Shippo. Definitely one now to Robbie. That's all it'll be. Marlene just looking like she's making her way in now. So yeah, It could be a little while yet. Yeah, she's, she's hugs from everyone. Yeah, every person <laughs> she walks past <laughs> has given her a ma massive hug. Congratulations. Um, So Shippo, interesting here what he plays. He's only one down on the head. He may be looking up this backhand. Yeah, he is trying to sit that bowl through. So we're just stopping because Lee's making announcements. Yeah, but Warren's on a good line here, Benny. Will he hold enough? Oh, he doesn't want to... Might get a result. Well, Might get a result. Oh, see that pole roll around. 
<laughs> it's just kind of it was just going to roll over, but it actually turned on itself. So it's just spun around on the in the finger uh, indentations. They're pretty deep ones too. Is that the Taylor? They've got those new ones. I that don't know if they're really deep. Yeah, Robbie's not happy with his line. So one, one to Robbie Warren. And well needed too, you know, like Warren getting that four was really important for Robbie to get a shot on that end. And it's end for end. Keep that keep that gap nice and close and tight. That's it. End for end is the trend now. After the twenty third end, eighteen sixteen, his boys are playing a long game. Neither will let go. Don't worry, so are the senior ladies. And yeah, sixteen all. Sixteen all, and that's correct as our scoreboard outside. Says as well, so it's what we expect at finals. We love it. <laughs> Robbie. <laughs> I don't know if you saw that in the background, he's just practicing his bowling. Yeah, he wants to throw it over him. He knew he was short. <laughs> he's got the uh, the shape of a fast bowler too, actually. I reckon he was would have been a ripper back Ooh, in the yeah. day. Bit of a bit of a Bruce Re or oh, Glenn McGrath sort of <laughs> Dennis Lilly. That's what I'm thinking. Just, yeah. yeah. Just got that long, tall um, figure about him, so Okay, so Warren also dropped short here, so still plenty of room for either to get in. Just gotta hold out on that line. Janine Brown, thanks for that. Appreciate the feedback, mate. Well done. And uh, you too, Ryan. Perfect. Robbie's using tailored GTRs, Glenn Dixon says. And, and Darren Draper, the answer to that is no. Thank you. <laughs> okay, Warren want to adjust a couple of feet here. He's out on a really good line, so giving this every chance. Great bowl coming in here, Warren Shipley. Yep, little touch on it. Spectacular. Very good draw, actually. Important one. These first three bowls pretty short. Robbie's out there too now. Will he pull back enough? He has. I don't know. I think he's just gone through. Jump up and have a look. He yep, has. one to, one to Shippo. So Shippo's about a bowl in front. Robbie's about... There we go. I think Mark has indicated about a foot behind. Mm. Oh, Cabra Matters here. Sorry, I can see Karen Murphy. The great Karen Murphy over in the back uh, having a roll-up. Yeah, the Commonwealth Games women's oh. gold, women's pairs gold medalist, Alan Fife, also out there. Yeah. yeah. Talk about Karen. Most capped Australian player ever in any sport. And a uh, order of Australian medal. Warren Shipley. He's got that. De well. Did he move it back? I don't think he's kicked it back too far, but I do think it's only one shot. Just looking at that. Yeah, Robbie's coming to have a look. I think it is only one. Still holding shot, Warren is, with that bowl right on the line, the toucher. There's no real heavy run on there at all to split them, which if those bowls weren't in front, I'd, I'd expect. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, no. There we are. The thing is that the bowl on the line is actually to the left of the jack a bit, so he... But he wants to be careful not coming down and tipping his own. He's only one down. Yeah. In this tight game, you don't want to be giving sh any shots away at all. And, uh, yeah, with the, the bowl on the running edge as well, it can just fall and flop out a little bit for... Uh, Warren will have two. Yeah, Warren will have two because it's pretty close. Doesn't want that. You know, he's catching up now. Warren's already two ahead. Put Warren Shipley on 20. If he's not careful, so. so he's on a slightly wide draw line here, so he was asking, asking it to pull right back. It was a pretty good shot in the yeah, end, but was. hasn't got the result. Oh, oh, nearly flopped back down onto that. That was if a little hard got, attack. Yeah, if he got contact on that, could have been very interesting. He's trying to bring his own ball forward. Yeah. He's playing for that. That's crazy. <laughs> oh, I love it. Back a sec. See if I can grab my lean. Uh, 
Okay, Shippo here. Would love to try and sit down that second shot of Robbie's. If he does, he can nearly make three of it here. And his line's good. That's a good start. He's now down to his weight. Will he pull all the way back to that Robbie Warren bowl? Warren Shipley has. I think he may have flopped it out for three shots. That's a sensational bowl, Warren Shipley. You know, having to see that from when I was hunting Marlene. And it That's is. a cracker. Three shots. What a great bowl there by Warren Shipley. I reckon that's huge. It I reckon that's huge. huge in the context of this game. 21-16 now. He's suddenly in the, in the hot seat on the launch pad, the oh, checkout, yes. whatever you want to call it. Can win this with one end. And Robbie Warren pretty much has to be perfect from now. And I think there's a little bit of adrenaline in the shoulder there. He's just, <laughs> just fallen into the, um, the ditch. Ditch. And Marlene hasn't made her way in yet, so I haven't, haven't been That's out right. of find her. She's still out there hugging people, I think. That's all right. Fair enough, too. Not every day you win a state championship, man. No, definitely not. It's hard to get. <laughs> and the open category is so big. Oh, sorry, the open reserve category is actually so big as well. Yeah. So she's done very, very well. Yeah, it's very well supported across our state at our sectional level and then zone level obviously so every rink out there on the green behind us is full and we're going down the bottom no one down the bottom at all silly people so the ladies are now 17 all so staying very tight out there the lady seniors mm. 17 all the green keepers tell me that that green's closed so i'll just shut my mouth <laughs> Oh, too many dips. Sorry, everyone. There we go. Where are we at? <laughs> Champagne, Shivo, great bowl. Yep, everyone's celebrating this one, this thing. Betty Rouse was saying you'd like to see Shippo smash it for six. We're talking about the bowling, uh, the practice bowls that was, hap <laughs> that was happening earlier. Yeah. I'm pretty keen to get Marlene, mate, so I'm just going to duck out again and see if I can find yep. where she's gone. Okay, Shippo down here. Just got to hold now to the jack. Just dived under. Give it every chance. Robbie. Very important. I think he needs to really win this end. Otherwise, the way this game's going, it's very, very hard for him to come back. And Robbie Warren down well. Wants the jack. Has moved it across. So moved it away from Shippo's bowls there. Two shots. Robbie asking the question here of Shippo. And he's very well down. Grasped very, very nicely. Very well weighted here. Up now, Shippo. He has. He's drawn a toucher. Oh, he would have loved to it fall for it to fall down. Hasn't quite, so. Well, we'd be looking to push up to that now. And that line is somewhat. No, he's got too much weight. Gee, Shippo's come good, isn't he? He the, has. In this game, he's just hit another gear, and he away has. he goes. ATM's got the skills. He just need to perhaps calm down a bit, not look at the scoreboard one at a time. Oh, mate, he, he knows what to do, mate. He's, yeah. he's, been, he's played for Australia. Yeah, he's very, yeah. In the over 60s. 17 all in the uh, senior ladies, I think, over there at the moment. Yep. That's close. Shippo really wanting to put another one in here. Put some number pressure on. He's a little bit wide this time, but he would love to even at least get third. Don't know if he has. No, so. A little bit of an opportunity on here. A hit and sit. Get the ball neat. And stay. He can get himself a three. Much more aggressive line from his first. It's just ducking. Took a little bit of weight off too, so that's what caused it to turn. Warren Shipley, one shot. Well, 
Three to win now for Warren. 22-16. By far the biggest, uh, twice the biggest lead. So it's uh, six shots. Previous biggest lead was three. So monster uh, ends coming up here for both the Warrens. So look across at the senior women's and both ladies have one bowl to play still. And Wendy's just gone up to the head. Wendy's currently holding th three shots over there, but they've both Guess still who? got one bowl to come. Guess who's here? We have a very, very special guest and a big smiling face. Congratulations, <laughs> mate. Put that headset on. Welcome, Tuck everybody. That microphone right in front of your mouth there. And Maylene uh, Reynolds. Hello, everyone. Congratulations. Thank you, Ben. You are the latest state champion uh, for 23-24. How does that feel, mate? Yeah, I think I make a better loser than a winner. <laughs> <laughs> what a great Many answer. that know me, oh, yes, I am like that. Yeah. But no, what great feeling, great feeling. What a great answer. I know you're the clubhouse favourite. Everyone's, you should have seen the support that was coming through on the uh, live stream for you, mate. We're, we're uh, all excited for you in here, I can tell you now. Oh. You played a pretty good game too. You got ahead a bit. Thank you. I had to try and get the synthetic mentality out. Yes. Yep. Yes. Yeah, because you've been playing that lightning fast uh, uh, green over at North Double Iris of Sporties. And, uh, you yes, and well, we're getting that thrashing by JF, uh, Don Ferguson from yep. Guy Mir BC, who prior to coming to state, he gave me the challenge. We call it a whittle. We've got a great he bowl there by did. Shippo. Surely sorry. did. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but then I learned that green well, so... Yeah. Here I am today. Yeah, came through and won the next two games and won through the finals with a margin. And uh, today, just doing really well on that green. And uh, big celebrations out there when you when you actually won, weren't there? There was. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm used to the limelight. I like the back. Stay in the back there. No, uh, you've done very, very well. We're very proud of you. You've got a big crowd of supporters here too, by the way. Lots of Northmead shirts. Yeah. Uh, I'm excited for you. You're a mate of mine. I'm very proud of you, mate. Thank it's really you good. Ben. So good job. You yeah, even got um, a phone call from me, boss, asking how you're going and uh, <laughs> told him that you won. So Cyril, uh, very happy with you, with you, uh, with your success, Marlene. <laughs> well, mate, I'm not going to hold you up. I know you're not, this is not really your thing. Well, so. while I'm while I'm yep. on now, I'll just say uh, to all the Zone Ten boys, yeah. Well, you won't see Ma in the reserves. <laughs> so you're safe. <laughs> Look and out! Th thanks everyone out there for your support. I really appreciate no, it. You're Thank awesome, you. Marlene. Going. Enjoy your victory, mate, and uh, we'll see you at the presentations. Thanks so much right. for coming. Thanks Thank for you your time, Mark. Thanks. Appreciate it. Thank you. Uh, just wanted to grab Ma for a minute. I know it's really yeah. not her thing. <laughs> it's just speak. Oh, it's great that she just could give yeah. us that couple of minutes, you know. Yeah, um, perfect. Brilliant. So she can go and celebrate now, enjoy her afternoon, catch up with all the supporters. There's a lot of, lot of Northmead shirts out there. Look at look at uh, back to the game. Look at Warren Shipley. That that shot, as you said in the middle, when Marlene yeah. was speaking, that's uh, yeah. a good touch up. Shipo can really put some number pressure on here. Get another one in there. He doesn't want to leave it wide. He would want to come across, try and sit maybe just in front and count. He's got the toucher on. His line's good. It's all on his pace now. He wants to run up just a little bit more to count. I'm not I sure. I don't think it has. I think Robbie's still got it there. I think mm, it's sitting, so. because it's sitting a little shorter, okay. it's about the same angle. So oh, Robbie's just pulled up. He, he had a shot in mind, just pulled up. Yep, he wants everyone to stop behind yeah, the head. Yeah, movement this. behind the head. He's pretty uh, adamant about that, actually, isn't he? I, mean, I, don't, okay. I don't hate it. He's played some very solid weight here. Just a bit narrow, though. He's not happy with himself. <gasps> oh! <laughs> <laughs> I'd stop watching. I'd yeah. read that off and I heard your gasp. Yeah. Oh, my God. He nearly back cut that in, but what I was more worried about, he was going to get it out fat, and he could have been two down. So. Uh, one. 23-16. Shippo creeps closer to a senior men's single state championship. And Robbie Warren's got a lot of work to do here. Ooh, well, what view's that? That's the grass. That beautiful green surface. Not a breath of wind out there now. That little breeze has even uh, gone away. The 
wind, the flags are just hanging down, absolutely dead. Uh, as we set this, oh, I think he's lost it again, Shippo. Yeah, I reckon that adrenaline's pumping at the moment, hey? Oh, no, he didn't lose oh, it. No. My apologies, yep. Did stay look at that. Dead still, those flags. There is not a breath of wind out there. So it looks like roll-ups on green three are about to cease. The uh, green keepers are going to get out there and obviously do a bit of preparation work ready for round one of our fours. Yep, they're having a, a chat. It's finished on one already. So, yeah, the fours they're kicks doing, off. Doing great work. They're, they're really managing their greens well. They're, they're still allowing roll-ups and play, working with the um, players a lot. You know, it's it's just run like a well-oiled machine. They're amazing it? here. Uh -huh. they're, they're, yeah, I've, I've not seen um organisation like this, the right. way the green keepers are running and managing the greens and the yep. players around them. And then, look, I'm going to say it again, the surrounds here are immaculate. Oh, wow. Yeah, they, they've done great work, like, um, giving players every opportunity to get on and, fit and, and use the facilities, get a feel for it, but time managing it as well so they can prep the greens for, for play as well. That's so. it. So they've been strict enough with the timing that the greens aren't getting worn out and... And destroyed. They've got not just because it's not just about obviously our state championships happen now, which is are going really well, and the greens are you know they're showing a little little wear and tear, but not nothing oh, epic as yeah. you'd expect with the high rates of usage. But uh, they've also got an Easter tournament coming up yeah. there as well. So you know, still, still got rounds of pennants next to play. And what comes up afterwards? So and then obviously um, later on in the year they've got the hundred twenty five thousand dollar fours as well. So yeah. really managing that usage right now can be important. Then they're coming into a cool cooler season, so it's hard to get the growth and get get that to come back. So, so nineteen seventeen over there with the ladies, uh, balancing the, the lady up. Yeah. That's pretty exciting too. That's a and good game. Wendy's coming to the head here. Well, she's following a bowl up. Looks like she's holding two out there as well. Uh, Wendy from Ballina. Mm. Might be three. So so Shippo here. Keep an eye on that. Yeah, they're a bit far away. I'm not going to be able to move my cameras either that far uh, no. afterwards. But uh, oh, if he runs up a bit more, he could have been holding game. But. Even, even it could be positive because if he moves Jack, he'd yep. be hiding game. You know, so that's what Robbie be looking for here. He's also experienced enough. And, like and, his line. Oh yeah, here we go. He's he's a bit runny though to come back. Just that little bit, but he's finished in a really good home. Oh, has he? No, it didn't. It's and not no, a ditch. Held up. So, Vicky Turner was just down three shots. She's trailed Jack, and I. Th Think, got, well, yeah, and got shot. shot. That's amazing. That's Nick's amazing. Door. Down nineteen seventeen, three down on the head. She trails the jack, gets shot. So nineteen eighteen there now in the senior ladies. So I'm going to say that Shippo needs to play a very similar shot to what Robbie Warren did. Oh, he can really tie this down with a trail now. Yeah, hold game and make it really difficult for Robbie. Okay, so line's good. Just down to weight now. Just down to weight. Just whoa. if See he gets what? the inside edge of that, well, he's flopped it down. Shippo holding game. You know what? It could be four down. I'm gonna. I'd, I'd say three at least. I think you're not far. Here comes Robbie. a heavy shot. Wants to clear them Very all out. Heavy shot. He's missed. Oh. There we go, ladies and gentlemen. Warren Shipley. Congratulations. <laughs> Our next uh, club or state champion for 23-24 is Warren Shipley in the senior men's singles. Congratulations to uh, the well-known character, Warren Shipley, from Soldiers Point. They'll be celebrating everywhere. Uh, played a pretty good game against Robert Warren. At the end of the day, it was Warren's consistency. Um, he just played a couple of really big bowls when it counted. We saw that one back down the other way where he was holding one. Played a perfect shot. Got a three out of it. He did a couple forehand runners back the other way to pick up extra shots. So, Well, essentially, the last... Well, they played 27 ends. Out of the last six ends, he won five. And uh, he only dropped the one. So it's a four, a three... 1-1-2 one, one, to win the game. Well, at least two there. Length changes the as well. Game. You notice Warren did pull mm. them shorter. 
and and seem to have a lot more control over that length. So yeah, a bit of celebration happening down there. You can see uh, for the lads they're cheering the crowd, really cheering them on. Lots of support here, of course, for both these players. They are popular characters. Uh, that was a great game. Oh, it was. And it was. Uh, once again, our live stream really showing up. We just seem to get the good games, don't we? Absolutely. Three Warrens down there. Three, Robbie so. Warren, Warren Towney and, <laughs> and Shipper so Warren Shipley. Looking across at the senior ladies. We can't get our cameras across. It's way too far to go. They, I think there's a movement for the fours of cameras. Is that right, Benny? Uh, I think we're going down the bottom, yeah. yeah so, okay, just, so. so that's for at one o'clock. Is that so? We've got some time to move it. We can hang around and just talk about it if you want, but I don't think I we're not going to be able to get any vision. It's hard it. to get the vision, obviously, but at the moment, Vicky Turner's holding three shots on this head. She is three pink bowls in around the jack. Here comes the she's she's followed it up. Wendy's just having a bit of a look. The obligatory uh, champions photos. Warren Shipley. Yes, <laughs> yes, there we are. <laughs> You'll see that photo on social media later. Uh, well done. Congratulations, Warren Shipley. Okay. Wendy's delivered here now. This is Wendy's third bowl. She is three down on the head. She's following it up. Let's see what I can see. She's got a bit of weight. She's sh hit a short one. Uh, I, know you got it. I think she's still at least two down. Still maybe three. Right. Well, there I'll we just, go. If I just use camera three, we might get a bit of a yeah. view and we're going to have a chat Happy about it. Happy to stick with you and give you. May as well. So this is the senior ladies final. We think it's de it was definitely two. We're not sure about the third. Wendy's front bowl there may have third. Lots of love for Warren Shipley on the text line, oh, on the chat line. Well deserved. Yeah, well deserved. Magnificent, popular Jeez. character. <laughs> Does a lot for our sport administratively as well. So. Good to see him get some accolades for his performance on green, not just for what he does off green. Now, Vicky's dropped in a really short one. Whether that was deliberate or not, I'm not sure, but... <laughs> and our Lady Marker will be loving that she's on the live stream. Oh, yeah! <laughs> <laughs> She's stoked. <laughs> uh, <laughs> excellent. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Love it. As we got that yeah, awesome Shivo juice. The comments are coming thick and fast. Uh, Nathan was there and asked if we're still here on Thursday. No, Wednesday's the last day. Thursday's our travel day. We'll uh, join the the post uh, tournament celebrations here at Club Dubbo first off, and then Wendy's up. Have a look. Oh, she's got into the front there. So let's see what that does. And keep an eye on the marker with their indicators. Got the paddles there. Wendy's happy to give two away. all it is so two there to Vicky Turner so new leader again Vicky 20 from Warilla Wendy 19 from Ballina I'll just get we'll just go back to the head and have a look at uh, sorry the mat and see what's going on oh she's gone all the way back that's why it took so long to find her look at that all the way back here so Yeah, and see where Kay's standing there she is. So the next games, the fours kick off at 1 o'clock this afternoon on the bottom green. We'll have to run out and move our cameras and see if we can get some lunch in as well. And uh, yeah, I think you'll be joined on the broadcast by someone else. I'm going to have an admin afternoon. Yep, you've got some work to do, buddy. Oh, Definitely. there's a few emails building up in there, which <laughs> I need to get on top of, So, which is all good. So, um, yeah, admin afternoon for me. No worries. We'll find someone. I've got one. Uh, oh, Shipley, if nothing I think else. we might need to get Shippo on. He needs to have a bit of a discussion about his win. Well, and, he's, in, uh, he's in the club now. I'll quickly grab him. Reach out to his fans. Okay, Vicky's first bowl is only about a bowl in front of Jack. It is about a foot wide. Wendy's just 
dropped in about she's about four foot short there. Uh, score on the ladies is 20-19 to Arilla. And Vicky with a second. She's got good weight. Just come underneath. So she's about, again, about a bowl short, but on the other side of the jack. Yep. So holding two. So she plays not in the club yet either. Don't know where these guys vanished to. He might be going to have a... That's all right. In, well, the, in the... In the Pokey room or something, we'll check his horse, <laughs> check his races. We will endeavour to get him on the live stream for the in the during the next round or the first round of the fours. So Wendy's up here a little bit better. She's shot, made contact, flopped, and got the shot. Some of you can I get for you here? I'm just going to swing my cameras around without moving them, just to see what I can find for Play you. Play with the other cameras at the end of the rinks from our live stream. This, this camera is the camera that's on the green, in the middle of the green it is, off to the side. But we will tr stick with you till the end of this game. Try and talk it through. Vicky Turner, come down. She's Whoa. just missed the jack. <laughs> and I could tell, because I'm looking out the window, they're coming back down towards the end that we're sitting. And I could tell that she was... I've got a better angle of it where I am sitting. That's it. So I would move oh, this, look at that. I would shift these cameras across, excuse the angle, but uh, I actually don't have cabling set up at that distance, so we just have to stick with what we've got uh, for the last few ends, and at least we'll get to watch a bit and find out who our state champ is at the end. So that one there of Wendy's is about a bowl and a bit short of Jack in front of the line, on the line basically. She wants to get inside of that bowl. Great bowl, Wendy Clark. Sitting now for two shots. I can imagine there'll be plenty of support there for the Ballina lady. I know the North Coast up there, they really love to support all their players. They really do. Okay, Vicky Turner's following this one down. She's turned the bowl over. Oh, got it. She might only be one down now. But Vicky's yeah, it's Wendy, close. Wendy's coming up to have a look. I like when players do this. The head's changed. Get, yeah. Ensure you've got the shot. Have a look at the spaces. Have a look at where you can get to to count. A head like this, and she's got everything behind against her. She doesn't want to go near Jack. Mm. So have a look at where you can get to to count. Go back and play it. Yeah, exactly right. So, Anne asked me <laughs> if I know those. I don't know them. No, I haven't met them before. But lo still lots of support coming in from both Shippo and, uh, and Ma. <laughs> she doesn't like being the live stream. Yeah. Trace, yep. Sean Aspel, how are you going, Triple M? <laughs> oh, I saw someone else said I got my own advertising banner in the background. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it's sticking all over the place, isn't it? <laughs> well, as long as you're entertained, I'm happy. <laughs> So I think Wendy will be probably wanting to play this wide. If she gets back to the pink bowl wide, so that's already behind Jack. There's no, but she she can't cut it in for shot. So, so you'll see the bowl coming just in the range very shortly. Her weight looks good from my angle, but where's it? Oh wow, she's actually very heavy. <laughs> that ran through, didn't it? Well, that's not the angle you want. That's so, what we're looking at. I think she's only got the one. Stop using that camera, Ben, that one. Yeah. Wendy put a finger up as well and said it's only one, so. 20 all now. 20 all. Five shots each left. We'll set this camera up to the other end. Benny's doing some great work here with his gear. <laughs> it's complex. <laughs> trying to get to this range and trying to get the best views. Try, but uh, Try and give as much footage as possible out there to our viewers. Yep, we want to keep this going. Everyone's interested in, in these, especially Warilla will definitely be watching this right now. I'll wait for the jack to come down. As it come, there it is. I'll zoom in and see where it finishes. Well, pretty long. We can see that, can't we? That, that roll on that green, so a lot, bit more speed in the greens today than what they've been used to over the last week or so since they had that massive storm and greens were underwater there. She's just looked at the camera there and said, uh-oh. 
<laughs> she, <laughs> she knows when it's looking at her. <laughs> I like that. That's very funny. Uh, what's the other camera got? Let's have a look. If it's way back, I'll get a good side view. Oh, just underneath, but about a metre behind. That's about as good as I can get on that view, but I think the middle one's better. Yeah, we can see the bowl running in, Benny. Yeah. That's a lot better. Vicky Turner comes down. She's finished about two bowls short, but probably got the shot. Looking at this intently, she's gone through the hole. Very unlucky. She had two bowls in good in a good area. Any movement of Jack, and she can get herself a couple of shots there. So comes Vicky down, probably trying to just get to behind, get some position early. So Leroy's just brought the times forward a bit, so it's not 1 o'clock anymore. It's about 12.40 we may kick off, so good luck getting lunch in. Thank you, commentators. Cop that. It's <laughs> all right. We might have a couple of guest commentators, mate, so you can get a bit of a feed in. I'll let, <laughs> I'll let him see if he can run the cameras. Yeah. <laughs> all right. Wendy just wanting some... She got has she run right up to it. That angle. Oh, oh no. I'm unsure, but we'll get some indication here from the marker. Close. One down is the call. One down is Vicky. So Wendy drew the shot with that bowl. Vicky would be just looking for contact. Turn it over. Draw just around it. Weight's very similar for both shots. And Vicky's running up the green after this, so... What's she got? She's got the jack back. Vicky Turner played a brilliant bowl there. Grabbed the jack, trailed it for two. Wowee. What a shot. That's a great shot. Yeah, well, she might. Come on, have a seat, mate. Just two minutes, just to have a chat. Just, yeah. Warren Shipley, no no stranger to these headsets anyway, but uh, mate, congratulations, ladies and gentlemen, with us now, our latest uh, state championship, state champion, sorry, from the 2023-24 uh, Boston Spiles State Championships, Mr. Warren Shipley, congratulations, mate. Thanks, Ben. Thanks, Josh. Yeah, still uh, trying to let it sink in, really. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I reckon that was a, you played a ripper game, because it was tight the whole way, and then you got that four. And off you went. Yeah, look, we were struggling a bit, both uh, Robbie and I. We were, we were, we thought our bowls were good, and they were pulling up that metre short, which yeah. is very hard to correct on if you think your bowls are, are okay. But um, yeah, played a couple of lucky ones, mate, and got got a bit of a jump, and um, I couldn't win an end going back towards the road, and yeah, uh, threw the jack in the ditch and let him throw. Yeah, the I end. saw that. And, yeah, twice and, actually. Um, yeah. yeah, so we. Mate. You played a One couple of howlers back towards this end where we're sitting. Forehand weighted shots. You played two absolute howlers to turn the head where you might have been holding one, but you turned it into th threes, I think, both times. Yeah. And yeah. then a backhand back down this way. So you're really finding the direction back towards this bottom green a lot better. Yeah, look, the... the <laughs> The hand on the on the ditch side is uh, a little bit little bit sticky, a little bit holdy there. But uh, the other side was was nice and wide, and and they're my drives, mate. Them yeah. bowls. Uh, <laughs> um, the comments come through. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I actually three. put one of my bowls in the ditch, which is very unusual. But, yeah. Yeah. So it's three to the uh, three to Vicky there, just uh, keeping that keeping a track of that one on the so, long long ends. But yeah, mate, you played a. A ripper of a game. I'm not going to hold you up too long. Just thanks for coming and having a chat. We looked at the uh, the live score. It's gone now. Don't worry about it. But the uh, live scoring, there were real trends. You guys with the, the momentum shifted. Yeah. 
in, in different directions, and then he went shot for shot, uh, sorry, end for end. You've got that four, dropped the one, and then won all the rest of the ends, all yeah. the way to the finish. Yeah, yeah. well, yeah, you get that bit of momentum and a bit of... Yeah, you play a couple of good shots to give you a bit of confidence, and, yeah, yeah all of a sudden the game's over. And 25, when I... I think the score was 15-14, and I'm mm-hmm. thinking, oh, we've got a bit to go, but you're more than halfway, and you start to yep. think, geez, uh, you know, could be over in a few ends, so, yeah, no, mate. keeping on that scoreboard. Well, Shippo, you've done really well, mate, real proud of you. Go and enjoy your celebrations, yeah. uh, and thanks for joining us, mate. Off to, um, off to Sporties now, they're playing the fours. Yeah, congratulations. <laughs> Good luck in that, mate. Good, Good luck, luck changing mate. greens. Well done. Well done. Lovely to speak to the, okay, uh, the winners so as they come through. I really enjoy that. So 23-20 now to Vicky Turner from Warilla. After picking up a three last end. With a great trail with her third bowl to hold two. Wendy just went through and then she's bang, dropped the third one in. Yep. And, and basically taken the free kick. So how many times have we seen the importance of that free kick oh, for, over these championships? Look at this, look at this bowl here. It's, a, yeah. it's short, but it's uh, the closest yeah. so far. And that scoreboard pressure is really going to start showing here at the moment. Yep. Uh, now that I've got the camera sorted out, I can actually start talking about the game again. So ah, <laughs> ball, these little pink bowls. <laughs> so, Wendy just wants to run up here. Just pulling up that metre short, so... Big opportunity here. Looking at the way the head's setting up, like Vicky lands this right on Jack now and could spell some difficulty here for Wendy. She's just gone through a bit there, but in a good home. Look, she's holding two, she's holding game. She well, is. That's it. At this stage. We're just looking at the round of applause in the background as well. Uh, definitely holding game. Don't get much of a better angle on that one. The three's good. So, so Wendy need an adjustment of weight here. First one long, second one a bit short. Hopefully she finds it. Well, it's long. she's just pushed through there. Two down there. We are... <laughs> Big bowl here. Vicky, Vicky gets right on top of this jack here. We can just about close it out. Although, Wendy does have the best back. Yeah, that's right. There is a, a heavy shot on. She's she running would, after it again, Vicky. She would love to close this jack off and make life a lot harder for Wendy. Here comes Vicky. She's got good weight, so... Oh, good shot. Yeah, but she's got a little bit of a bank there now. Wendy can sit on either of she those and get the shot. She can sit on those, but I don't see a heavy shot. She can't run nah. through and get a multiple. But she's got to draw, draw this dead. It's just a draw. Um, weight looks heavy again, mate. Um, Maybe a little, no, it's pulling up. It no, is pulling she's up. She's got a lot better weight here. Does she pull up enough though? Wendy Clark down oh. game has drawn oh, 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 the absoluter. Great ball. Shot. Jeez, that looked quick. I got all all uh, all excited and then just stopped. So that's so great. We go the to game another. continues. Yep. And that's what state championships all about. That's what helps you win championships. Being able to pull out the big bowl in the big times. We saw it yesterday with Jay Bruce too, didn't we? We did. Yeah, yes, just, that's exactly what he did. Just produced when he was under the pump. So I did see an interesting post last night. I've got to agree with it. Lee Schrainer said championship, uh, well, something along the lines of um, big games, big championships, uh, one T to T. Um, something along them lines, yeah. yeah. And, and that's exactly what we saw Jay Bruce do. Um, in the men's final yesterday. Stretch that right out, T to T. So that's on the T. Okay, just giving us the mark there. On the, the indications. So I'll just get the best view I can. That's about it. So 23-21 here. Sarah Boddington, silver medal winner yesterday. Yeah, getting... Just walking in front of us now. Getting ready for her fours campaign. Wendy Clark's oh, got a little up. touch us. Went through, though. She's Cross four foot behind. But <laughs> Vicky watching intently here. She's got really good weight there. Oh, perfect. Drawn across the line. She's got one. 
Raymond Terrace Mob just walking past us now too, Matty Bouse. That's a weird angle. That camera shouldn't be doing that. I don't know why it's leaning. doesn't matter. Someone's obviously knocked it. <laughs> fine, mate. That's fine. It's all right. But, uh, okay, Wendy just wanting to run up here. She has. It's just turned out, I think. Yeah, it's run through, so she's not holding. I think Vicky's got the, the shot at the moment. Yep. Chance for Vicky to get a second in there. She's been a happy character, this Vicky Turner. She's just this, it's she? so happy to be here. Yeah. <laughs> There's Timmy Twining and Lee Schreiner. Okay. She's looking all right here. She's just got to run up a little bit more. Well, yep. I think she, oh, no, I don't think that counts. I think uh, no, it's so hard to tell from here. We're so far away from it. But uh, the indication may come yeah. if the question's asked. It is about five rinks across from our camera. It's just, it's just having a look now. <laughs> Indication. No, just saying how the distance is between yep. them. Okay. Just listen to least into the background talking about the... Uh, the, what's going on? I actually did have a view there. I should have used that. That's all right. So we're watching this one go through. Wendy's watching intently. Has she run up to it? I think she's crossed. Oh, oh. she's crashed. I think it's still only one down, though. Yeah, I do too. Yeah, so opportunity here for Vicky. She can get another one in close. Ask the question again of Wendy. Obviously, Vicky with last bowl. Big advantage here. <laughs> Look at this thing. Green keepers and the staff are having to put all the chairs away. Everyone's been asked to bring them she back in. She just wants to crumb. run up a little bit more. Gets to that bowl. She's drawn oh, to. Yeah. Vicky Turner holding game. Once again, and another rescue needed. So, Wendy Clark. What does Wendy do here? Well, it's a tough shot. I think she's... I'd uh, like, yeah, it's hard to see without seeing up and down the rink, isn't it? I think she might have to go all or nothing here. Yeah, two shots at the moment to Warilla. I think. It's a hard draw because of so much traffic, but is it an all or nothing shot? You know, get into the pink bowls, or if you miss them, jack back for three. Yep. We know Vicky's still got another bowl to come, though. So yeah, well, Vicky will be hoping not to play it, to be honest. Oh, yeah, she's sitting down up the, next to the scoreboard there. Yep. <laughs> just Wendy having a good look and just... Taking in everything. <laughs> Just tossing the coins. And which way do I go? I don't know. There's, look, um, at that distance, she's thrown a pretty long end. But there is a heavy shot on there. She can uh, hope to yeah. bash one of uh, Vicky's bowls out, True. move the jack back to her two at the back. Yeah. Uh, I don't see a draw either either hand, actually. So she's going to have to clobber this. Yeah. I think we're going to see a back, backhand weight. Up under those bowls that are on the backhand, if she's inside of them, she's very close to a result. She can get onto the pinks. She may just be looking to bash into the pinks as well and get them out, or at least get one out. So let's see what she selects here. It looks like a forehand. And it looks like she's... Yeah, it's aggressive weight. So... Let's see what the line is. Waiting for it to come here now. They're looking intently. Both ladies are looking very intently. Oh, She's got one out. Oh, oh, oh. Keeps herself in the game. That's the shot she was looking for. She's uh, one down still, I'd suggest, but that's a great shot. What a cracker. Vicky looking at it. Does Vicky think she still she might have two? I don't think so. No, no, no. Probably either. just looking at how to get a second and... What a, what a shot. A great, great shot. She's... Thrown it back to Vicky, saying, you want this, you're going to have to draw it. That's it. Come and get it. If you miss, we'll go another end, and I'll have another crack at you. <laughs> Isn't it amazing? Oh, yeah. Yeah, so Vicky has indicated to her, the crowd behind her rink. There's only the one. Wide draw on the back end here. Beautiful form. Oh, no, she's playing a forehand. Interesting. I don't think she can get around there. 
She has just played down there a few times. Looks to be a little tentative, yeah. She might have thought there was a bit of danger in amongst yeah. there, so... Creeps close up. On the tip of the diving board. <laughs> She's ready to dive in head first. That was remarkable. Yeah. 24-21 now. Wendy Clark doing very well to give herself every chance, keeping herself in the game. Yep, one is the decision. So, so I'll just skip across the scoreboard and show you that. 21-24 right now. Both players on the springboard or the checkout or launch pad. They're all there, ready to go. We can win it in one end. Vicky just a lot closer to victory in the end, contextually, than Wendy. Don't go and kill the score guard. Okay. Can we see Wendy get a couple in close here and... Vicky Turner, very well down. What a great bowl. She's well, finished. A that's a classic. Good enough to Jack High, maybe just half a bowl behind, but straight away putting some pressure on Wendy. So can Wendy reply here? And she wants to be given every bowl a chance here. Nothing short. Yeah, and I like that weight. She's given it a chance, turn the bowl, move the jack, but she's also given it a chance to count later on, so we don't want to see anything short here. So she's holding game. I've just come back and had a, had a chat with Luro for a sec just about uh, the arrangements for this afternoon for the fours. Uh, yeah, well... Done it. She's got second shot. She's probably finishing a good home, so visually it'll look a bit harder there for Wendy. She might not be able to see Jack. Jack well hidden. Jeez, I'm a long way away, and I was zoom in a bit so we can actually but see. I'm she's to actually get... swapping hands, so I might have finished on that Oops. side of the green a little bit more. So it's a long way. Here we go. Focus up. Wendy there. swapping hands. Here she comes, she's and she Jack. turned in. Oh, she's got the shot. Jack back. Wendy Clark played an absolute cracker. <laughs> what a shot! <laughs> Two shots to Ballina. <laughs> That's incredible. And I got a bit excited there. That was brilliant. That was a great shot. <laughs> Fantastic shot. Wendy Clark fighting right to the end here. Again, saying, Vicky, you are going to have to play brilliant to beat me. <laughs> and uh, and Vicky's down well here too. How's uh, a weight? Well, I think she has. Oh, no, nah, drop back to... But look who's here. Okay. Aaron Tees. Andy Conlon. Oh, jeez. Luke Jones. No, the look stars. At Don't get out and look at it. Tees and Henry. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> the North Coast boys are in town. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Okay, no, so... No, that's, that's what I want. In, no indication from the marker as to who's got shot. Oh, stop it. But Wendy Sorry, here man. can play a big bowl. Any little movement of Jack and she can be holding three. So is she up? Uh, looks a little tentative. Wants to run another metre. Not quite, so. What a shame. It would have been good to see her get up and reach there and have an option of trailing Jack for four <laughs> and game. So, all right, Vicky's released. It looks like she's playing down the backhand here, Vicky. Ooh, something just broke. Sorry, everyone. And Jeez, I'm trying to keep up. Somewhat there aggressive. Can't yeah, it's quick. Tell the line here. She's, oh, oh, she's gone right through. Got the oh, jack. Got the jack. I didn't even see that on the camera. She's, she's got the jack. She has. So she's holding shot. Holding shot at the back, but there's a fair amount of distance. Yeah, but if I go, pressure can do some funny things. So, <coughs> so that's it. That's what's in confronting now. Uh, confronting Wendy now. Wendy's got the next two because she had the best ones back, but. Well, what, a, what a shot, Vicky. Come on. Because the jack's over the other side of the green, her two blue ones there do are second woods. Would Cup. she have a crack at that bowl? I, other players might. I think she'll draw. <laughs> but yep, with that much is. room and down game, 
She's She's looking for a dead draw here. You and I just don't have an angle on this at all. Her run looks all right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There she's got the shot. Wendy Clark. Brilliant bowl. Again, keeping herself in the game with some pressure bowls. So, 24-22 now. Wow. This just keeps going. (laughs) This is what it's been in the finals, though, isn't it? Oh, my goodness. <laughs> What's up? Oh, just uh, have a bit of fun with Lukey. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Thanks for sticking with us, everyone. <laughs> He can't see. He's looking straight at the window, but I know. <laughs> can't see in through these windows. No, definitely can't see. <laughs> All right. What a great finish. 24-22. Wendy Clark really fighting. <coughs> oh. Yeah, non-stop she's... Uh, look, Vicky would be uh, just keeping an eye on the score. Just, just saying, like, why can't I just get one more? I've just got a uh, message from the CEO at Cherry Street. Ballina, Cherry, come on, bet Wendy. All the Ballina's watching, bring it home. <laughs> Ooh. Good. Well, so, I'm glad we're able to bring it to you, mate. Wendy's got a pretty good first one in. I mean, now to move the cameras for you, but uh, at least we get to watch and see who's crowned chairman at the end. She hasn't given up your club mate there from uh, Ballina. And the Ballina boys are out there on the sidelines now. Supporting her as well, which is great to see. They've obviously just rocked in. These two balls look about the same distance yeah, away. Not, I mean, sh- not, sure who's got, not sure who's got shot there, so. Yeah. Angles are a bit deceiving. Yeah, they look like it's a long way away from us. At least five rings across from the from where we watched uh, Warren Shipley um, have a really good victory over Rob, Robbie Warren, the bowls legend. Wendy looking intently. Just, oh, God, gets a little oh, bit of jack, so I think that guarantees one. I think it's probably two, but still lots of room there, Benny. That's right. So it is 22-24 right now. I'm going to get rid of that scoreboard in the bottom right because he's not helping at all. Vicky with her second bowl. She's uh, got a good weight. She under that or oh, just crashes, but... No, I still favour the ball yeah. on a blue bowl for one. Don't think it's two now, though, but... I mean, sometimes when you're chasing one, it's the hardest Wendy, shot to get. When you're swapping hands here, I, uh, drawing the jack neat here would be unbelievable and can go a long way to secure in her game. She's just a little bit through. She got any jack? Oh! Looked like a She gets through. the jack there. She's... She's trailing that for three and holding game herself. <laughs> all right, Nikki, what do you got, mate? Let's go. One more. That's all she needs. That's all she's chasing. Vicky's just looking to play that draw weight. Get to those bowls of Wendy's. If she's a little tight, she turns her she's, own in. She's after it again. She's got a little jig on. <laughs> she does. She's got the little, cool little running style. Oh, the weight's all right. The weight's all right. Well. Oh. Oh. Let's see I what the said that. Is. that was, there was always an option. Playing weight to them back bowls. If you're tight, get your own. You p- may push it in for shot, but... This is we're really a champion in the back there. We're, we're, we're really a character in the back there, Jimmy McRory. Just, um, Wendy coming up to have a good look. Yeah. Still no indication who has shot, so... I don't know. The nah. angles are so weird. Even Wendy's um, unsure. Checking the angles. See, the marker's got... Oh, no, that's a sunglass. I thought she might have had paddles. <laughs> Is Vicky coming to have a quick squiz as well? <laughs> no idea. Come on, quick let quick us know. Quick chuckle. <laughs> no idea. No concept. She had a laugh, though. Jimmy in the background. He's excited. Well. Let's 
see. Looks like she's I mean, bowling he's up, up on the forehand here, so... She, she, she's probably got the tiniest amount of adjustment to do from a last bowl. She can get the jack. She's running after this. Wendy's following this up. Just a matter if she's got the right run now. She's running, she's running. Wendy Clark, if she was down, has drawn the shot again. So, I wonder if she's got two, though. Well, two would make it more make it very, very interesting. That'll take them both to 24 on the last end. Wow. Zicky's got a bowl to go. How many big bowls has Wendy played? I know. Last, last few ends, just rescuing. Brilliant. Them. We've seen it quite a bit. You know, it starts with... Lambie Yedavadu in a memorable game where she won 11 out of 12 ends after being like 11 shots down or something and won the game. We saw it yesterday in the state final with uh, with Jay Bruce. Uh, yeah. Now uh, Just we may see it here once again. Champions playing champion bowls on championship ends. Exactly right. <laughs> so, Vicky. Over to you. Last bowl. Has chance for, to win this championship. She's got a little jig on herself. She has. Following her bowl up. She's oh, she sprinting. stops. She's, yeah, like a bowl, I think. Don't think she likes it. But, well. What's, ooh. Did it or did it not? I crossed under, I think. I crossed oh, under, oh. so... One yellow is going up in the marker's hand at the moment, and yeah, that means another one. one. 23 24. Another one to Wendy, so she's got to go up and get the mat. <laughs> <laughs> she's, and Vicky's looking at the crowd behind her, all the Warilla people behind her, just going, What is going on? Why can't I just get one more shot? 23 24. She's going to have to get the mat, didn't come down with it. It's feeling a bit like yesterday's game. It is. <laughs> it's great. That's what championships are all about, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, Darren Draper, Jimmy McRory lurking in the bushes. Yep, that's about standard, though. Uh, quite amazing. Okay, here we go. 23-24. I've got to move that camera. Sorry, I was just checking other things. Really love to see. I think if one of these ladies can get one right on it early. That's uh, T to T. What were you uh, saying? Oh, no, before? Matt's up. Matt's up Matt's a fair up, bit. Matt's up, is it? Oh, yeah. A couple of metres, yeah. I reckon Matt's up at three, four metres at least. So... All right. Who can hold their nerve here? 23 and 24. Uh, Wendy chasing two. Vicky chasing one. Wendy's down all right. Has she got the run, though? No, she's, she's short. So that's that's about close to two metres short out there, that is. Yep. And the green that's accelerating. A few nerves, maybe? Yeah. Well, Vicky's either quick or perfect. One of the two. Take your pick. Oh. So, as far as Wendy was short, Vicky was through. Not sure who's got shot, but I don't think the match winner's been played here yet. No way. Here comes the Dubbo City ladies in front of us as well. Their rhino shirts. Quite like them. Okay, Wendy looking intently. She can hold up. Close. Got Great the shot. jack beautifully. Wendy Clark holding one now. Really asking a lot of questions with Vicky. Vicky had that big gap. Wendy's just really knuckled down and said, if you're going to win this, you, you're going to have to earn it. And I'll tell you what, cards. I'll tell you what, Vicky, oh, oh, close, I don't know. angles are hard. Where's, where's Kay? I'll just try to zoom yeah, I'm out. I'm looking out the window see. myself. She's looking there now. Wendy's asked the question, who's got shot? I was saying one yellow. So one that, that is to balance. Balloner is yellow paddles. Obviously the red paddles to try and match the pink bowls uh, for Warilla. 
So Wendy would love to sit on this bowl of Vicky's. Look at her running. No, I love She's it. chasing this. Can't quite tell a line from our angle, but does she get the pink? She does. She sits the pink through. She's now holding game. Oh, but Vicky's got two back. Vicky's got everything behind. She only needs one. So there's no point in her chasing. She'll nah. just draw in between those bowls. And, uh, I've got a feeling this is a do or die end, you know. One of them are going to win this. Here on this end. She's not there. She's not she didn't there. reach. <clears throat> okay, Wendy Clark, what do you do here? I'm trying not to make a target. Well, <laughs> I think in the end. No, she, but, you know, the, she can't afford to go one down. She's got to defend. Wendy currently holding game. Both players with one bowl each to come. Vicky's everything behind, but I think she wants to nearly play something short and in Vicky's eye. Make it more difficult for Vicky to get through to the jack. If Vicky finds the path and gets to jack, well, it's just too good. But I just don't think another one in the head here is, is any good here. Something in front. She's got to make Vicky play. That's that's. The, well, she's already key. making a play holding no, it I mean, too. That's what I mean. She's yeah. holding it, but make sure she has to play instead of right. creating well, a biggish target. She's got some weight on this. She's yeah. actually tried to go behind. If she stays up, she's got the best back. Well, you know what? That's a really good option because now weight dependent. It's got to be precision to win this. Yeah, exactly. So holding game we right go. now, Wendy. Vicky's last bowl to either win it Vicky's or delivered. lose it. It's pretty much the, well, she's delivered. Chances, I think. They're watching it. Is she up? The battle of the clapping. Wendy's clapping. Is she up? When she's clapping because Wendy's Wendy funny. Clark has won the Senior Women's Over 60s Singles Championship. What a great display. Wendy was somewhat, I wouldn't say down and out, but the task ahead of her was massive, and she just kept producing the goods to keep herself yeah. in the game. Vicky got stuck on 24. That's it. One, <coughs> yep. one shot away. Yep. And uh, Wendy to come back, come from behind from uh, Ballina. So, so celebrate Ballina. You had the uh, boss on the line a second ago yeah. saying everyone's watching. <laughs> They'll be celebrating up there in the north right now, I can tell you now. But here concludes our singles coverage of... Uh, the 2023-24 Bowls Australia. Nope, your Bowls Australia. <laughs> I'm Bowls New South Wales. State Championships uh, Club from Club Dubbo. It's been a spectacular morning, mate. It has, mate. And um, next up, we have round one of the fours. We've got a camera shift to do. <laughs> exactly right. And uh, <laughs> So round one of the fours starts as soon as we can. We'll just um, have a little break and uh, move some cameras and see how quickly we get that done. But well done to our three new champions, Wendy Clark, Warren Shipley, and Marlene Reynolds will see you for the fours very soon.